access granted. Yo, Squid, how you doing? How's it going, folks? Oh, yeah, we don't need that. Atheline, how you doing? I, uh, sorry I'm late. I, uh, I do apologize for that. I, ho I hope you're well, folks. Uh, uh, I hope you're doing good today. Jesh, how you doing, bro? Are you well? I hope you are, sir. Um, I, uh, I was all good to go on time. I just had some things to take care of. I don't need to bore you with the details of my, uh, silly little life, but, <laughs> um, yeah, just one of those things. Uh, so here we are, a little bit late today, but it doesn't matter. How are you doing? It's the 13th of October, 2022. Um, yeah, no, I'm all right. I'm all right, Squid. You know, I'm fine. It's, uh, um, just timings. Um, uh, basically, my, it's not, I can tell you. It's, uh, basically my, my, uh, mum had made some food, uh, which was going to waste. So she was like, yeah, come and get this food. And I was like, okay, cool. Because um, uh, my uh, my stepdad uh, went into... He got rushed... In, not rushed into hospital. I guess he was kind of rushed into hospital. Um, he, uh, he had to have his uh, appendix out suddenly. Uh, and he's absolutely fine. It's just my mum was like, here, have this food. And he's like, I don't want this food. <laughs> my mum was like, oh, I made food. It's got, it's got to go to waste. Poops! How you doing? Yeah, I, I don't know. He, he seems absolutely fine, Squidge, but I think it was like it was close to not being fine, John. You know I mean? <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm very well. Thank you for being here, guys. Um, so yeah, he's fine. So there's some extra food, and then I was just like chatting my, with my mum and stepdad for a little bit. God, this town is freaking weird. While I was there, some random stranger knocked on my mum's door and was like, "Oh yeah, hi." Um, you know that uh, mobile home, that camper van you've got around, out around the corner? Are you selling that? My mum's like, how do you know we own that? No, she didn't. Yeah. Um, she didn't say that. Yeah, I should have answered the door. But uh, she's like, no. And he was like, oh, okay. I was like, how sus can you get? It seemed, sus. It seemed like a sus. Because it's like, how... It wasn't like, hey, do you know who owns that mobile home around the corner? It was like, yeah, that, we know that you own that. It's like, what the fuck? Yeah, it, it seems a bit more sus than strange. Um, strange, I can handle all day. Everyone's strange, Squidge, but I'm sure nothing's going to happen. But also, this is one of those towns where everything has been known to happen. Uh, <laughs> uh, just it's weird. I don't know, but the, to my mind, to what I said to my mum was like, if they were, if that guy was planning on stealing your camper van, he wouldn't have come and knocked on your door and shown his face do you know what I mean it would have just <laughs> do you know what I mean yeah a police report oh is there any suspicious people around recently yes <laughs> this is I, I, I looked him in the face this is what he looked like <laughs> do you see what I'm saying um yeah yeah she's she is friendly with uh the neighbours on both sides um it's just there like on the the end like almost at the end of a road uh, so there's no space on their road to park the camper van. It's like 90 degrees on the next road down. It'd be fine. Apparently it's got a tracking device in it as well. So it's <laughs> so even if someone did nick it, it's uh, they'd be, um, you know, they, they'd they'd be able to find the people. <laughs> I was like, you've got a tracking device? I don't think we're in the future yet, but apparently we are. Um, <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know anything about vehicles, do I? So I guess maybe that's a thing, but... Um, 
Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Af. It's like, but here, think about it logically. If you were planning on stealing something, you don't go and show your face to the person you're stealing it from. You know, you tr you're gonna, you just you're just gonna steal it. You're not gonna, you know. Um, uh I'll kill switchers. So you you've got you can literally just stop the vehicle working. I wonder if I wonder if they oh, they might have that as well. That's that's wild. I, I don't know about these things. Either way, that's cool. It's just a bit weird, but yeah, um, yeah. Squidge, Af, uh, Jesh, and Poos. I hope you're all well. Thank you for joining me. And again, sorry for the delay. It's just, just one of those things. I hope you're all having a good Thursday so far. It's very um, it's very nice and sunny. I don't know what it was like for you, Squidge. All of last night, it was lashing it down. Uh, rain like for our uh, American was that right? What's that? Uh, <laughs> it's raining a lot. Um absolutely crazy just howling wind and just rain coming down like like you know noisy noisy rain can't you know keeping you awake uh but now this afternoon it is sunny it's pleasant it's like you know spring afternoon almost um yeah well although that's you're not a good judge of these things squidge because you're like just <laughs> you're like oh it's cold no you're not no, obviously not because you don't have the windows open you know what i'm saying anyway yeah, I, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't feel it was to be cold at all. But I'll tell you this: uh, when I'm reading, I, I'm still trying to be in the habit of um, reading for you know, if not an hour, just like half an hour, just before I go to sleep. Much better than looking at your freaking phone. I'll tell you that. Um, you know, and it's like rather than sit down here, you know, I'm like oh, get in bed, read in bed, be comfortable while you're reading. Um, in the summer, I would just like just lay on top of my bed, be like, whew. Now, because I find it more com, I don't know about anyone else who's reading in bed, folks. When you're reading in bed, what's the best position for me? It's most comfortable for me to just lay down on my front and like have the book like propped up there in front of me like that. Um, some people maybe like sit up in bed, like you know, nine, you know, ninety degree legs with body in a in a comfortable sitting position. I think that's the standard. Um, I don't feel comfortable doing that. Uh, honestly, it feels weird sitting in bed. I want to lay in bed. Um, but of course, laying down like that is kind of like it's, it's almost like I just it's too cold. <laughs> it's getting time to get too cold. So I have to. Like, so I'm laying down on my back, being like, I'm like, oh, I'm getting an arm workout while I'm reading as well. Um, yeah, I yeah, I notice. I kind of I'm a bit fidgety as well, Af. Um, yeah, did you just want to switch? <laughs> um lay on your side yeah i'll try laying on the side but then i feel like i've got a, a spare arm that i'm just laying on that's getting in the way that's trying to like a, a little t-rex arm like holding onto a, an edge of a book <laughs> you know what I mean? like, uh, yeah it's my little t-rex arm holding on the <laughs> um but you know it's good it's good uh suddenly getting through the sandman i've not been able to read every night honestly some nights i've got distracted by something i've been doing some research or whatever and then i haven't but um i just started volume nine of the 10 that i have of sandman so i'll get through that uh and then i've got like one extra one that's like some not officially sandman but somehow related uh then i'm planning to uh get into squidge's book um yeah seven eight then my dear yeah i found that the most comfortable position and I suppose you could lay down with like your cover over your back, but that also feels like a little bit claustrophobic. Um, you know, I'll just like lay on top of my bed, but of course, when it's cold, you know, I'm like, oh, no, <laughs> it's too, it's too cold. My butt, my butt cheeks are cold. Uh, <laughs> um, so you know, you make do, you make do. First world, talk about first world problem. Oh no, I'm a little bit too cold <laughs> when I'm when I'm trying to read. In, in my house. <laughs> it, on my comfortable bed. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It, you know. Anyway, thank you for being here. How are you doing, Seven? Are you well? You all right? Are you less fr frustrated today, Seven? You said you were frustrated last thing I saw you say yesterday. Um, I told you to message me, but maybe you just didn't want to involve me in your frustration. Or maybe you resolved it yourself. Um, uh, just be glad you're not there. Why am I, why would I be glad you're not there? I won't be, I'll, I'll probably won't be getting any reading done. So yeah, there you go. That's that's why. <laughs> um, yeah, what's going on? Um, Af, have you completely? Have you you got bored of, of Final Fantasy XI again? 
you coming back to it? Or are you still annoyed with like the elitists? You've been hanging out with Spoon a lot. Is he is he looking after you? Oh, Red Mage has apparently watched the first the the, the new ep, the the very first new episode of Bleach is out, and he's given it ten out of ten. I'm gonna have to wait two years, Red Mage. I can't be watching this weekly anime thing. It's just... I've got I haven't got time for any any or all of that. Um, you put you oh you, you get you, ah you get co uh, cold toes, dear. Um. Yeah, I. In when it, when we hit winter, I remember my feet get real cold. So what? Uh, and uh, so what I do is um, and uh, and my hands as well. Hands and feet get real cold. So I put my hands in my armpits like that. Because obviously your armpits, if you don't know, and your groin, uh, are the warmest parts of your your body, the external body. And you don't come. You know, I mean, you could. I was about to say, you can't put your hands inside yourself, but... Yeah, anyway, moving on. Um... Oh! Elder Scrolls Online? And I didn't get an invite. God, I'm not Af's favourite anymore. I'm, <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> um, excellent. Cool. Is it good? I um, I never played it. I, from when... I, I, do, I did have a copy when it was released. I just never got around to play it. I should come too. Oh, bless you. I appreciate that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I've heard it's much better, and they've like added a lot to it, and it is like a full fledged, fun, um, you know, MMO. It's like it's up there now. Um, you want to bother me? You, you guys could never bother me. Understand? I will tell you if you, if you, if any of you ever are bothered to me, I will tell you, because I'm not playing games. You know what I mean? We play games on stream, but <laughs> you know, some people are like too nice. I think that's bullshit. I don't like people who are too nice. Be nice. Be nice to people, but don't be too. No don't know. Be honest with them. You know. Don't don't don't, don't te be telling little white lies. Um. Yeah, it's gotten way better. This is what I've heard over the years. It's like they've like doubled down on it. Could be interesting. I don't know. I feel like I've had my MMO fix for the time being. Af, uh, I still got thing things. I'm like I'm still running around on eleven every night. I'm still getting doing bits and pieces of this, but they, I am somewhat limited by the fact that, of course, I can't. Um, I can't go to events with the end game link shell. So it's like, you know, all my jobs are at max level now. Um, I'm just skilling up my puppet master at the minute. Uh, that's been going pretty well. Uh, uh, you know, got a few few relics. Um, you know, I've avoided doing merit parties because obviously you get XP as you're farming dynamist currency. But if I get to the point where I've maxed out all merits on all jobs, that's going to, like, remove one of the, the birds from the two birds one stone of dynamis farming do you know what i mean i'm like and now, okay now i don't even need these points i'm literally just doing it hoping for currency that's going to take the uh that's going to take the, you know the, the sweetness out of doing that i'm like i can't, I can't even be bothered to do this to get like you know grind for like dozens of hours to get potentially get a relic that i might not get too much use out of you know what i mean this Still working on my uh, craft, leveling up on my crafts and stuff. But it's, you know, it could, it could get to a point where I either need to just like take a break from it. Um, I've I've had a good uh, good year of it though. I definitely if I enjoyed. Key, how you doing, Key? Um, it's nice to be important, but it's more important to be nice. Yeah, being important uh, that's all relative, isn't it? But um, if you're important and you're not nice, then you might as well fuck off. Um, my hands are not cold. I'm just sat like a weirdo. <laughs> Kitty's like, why are you sat like that? I'm not, uh, I'm just my little T-Rex hand. No, I'm just, <laughs> uh, how you doing? Kitty, now Kitty, um, has, Kitty plays a lot of kind of like, uh, farming, crafting, gathering games. But Kitty has also played a lot of MMOs. I think, uh, Kitty went hard on WoW back in the day. But have you ever played uh you got any experience with elder scrolls online key um 
yeah it's a it's a thing gaff so i don't blame you i, I just i'm you know you know i get to see you on stream don't i so it's like um you know it's just you know you, you just you were one of the loveliest people on the server so the fact that you're not there on a daily basis is kind of you know you, you're missed you know that's that's all um Ah, ah, interesting case. So you played it when it was released and you played it for about six months. Okay, so it must have been somewhat good. Um, Yeah, I know, yeah, you're still a GM and doing tickets. Ah, well, don't feel you have to. I know, well, I mean, you know, I know you're helping Spoon out because obviously if you don't, you know, people aren't helping out, then it's all on him and that's, you know, it shouldn't have, it shouldn't have to be all on him, should it? Um interesting kitty yeah yeah apparently it's come along a lot a lot since it was released um um what are the mmos that you have played seven i assume world of warcraft was one of them just i guess um oh is osmo in the process of moving is he okay cool okay well either way you know i'm like i say i'm in in the spectrum of someone's career of their character i'm like I'm still very much dedicated, but I'm like winding down. You know what I'm saying? I'm still logging in every evening for an hour or two after, you know, just before I go to bed. But I'm also, you know, running out of things to do. Not not running out of things to do. There's so much to do. But like, like you know what I mean? I, I don't need to XP ever again. Literally. Unless I'm joining a mer like for merits. But like I say, with the diner farming, I don't see that ever would be needing the case. You know, all those, all those uh, parties with Knuckles. He's still going strong. Um, but uh, never again, because I, I don't need it. You know what I mean? So it's like, eh. um, Hey, Lee. Thank you. Thank you, Lee. <laughs> hey, Dinley. Um, Ragnarok Online. Never. I don't even know if I've even heard of that, Seven. Oh, your brother worked for, uh, for, uh, for Blizzard. Oh, wow. Oh, excellent. Over 50. I'll go and even realize there's uh that many that look kitty is the resident expert i feel wow for eight years yeah i remember you telling me a little bit about that kitty like you were like got to get to the point where like why am i doing this uh every quest two for three years and 14 for six years now i assume that was it was it a case of you quit one and then start the next one and then quit that one and start the next one or you do you play them like all kind of concurrently depending on your mood um Uh, t tabula rasa, as in, as in the Final Fantasy Eleven server that started a bit a minute ago. Uh, but anyway, how you how you doing there, Lee? Kenny, what oh, there, Kenny? Sir Duct Tape himself. How you doing, bro? Are you well? I hope you're good, buddy. Um. You're doing just fine, Lee. I'm pleased to hear that. Um, oh, how curious! I didn't realise that. Yeah, it's it's weird. A, a new Final F Private Final Fantasy XI server uh, popped up recently. Uh, a brand new one called Tabula Rasa. Okay, interesting. Kit. I've never even heard of it. Let me, have, let me pull it up. Um, A defunct MMORPG developed by Destination Games. Okay. Released uh, in 2007. Okay. Okay. All right. It's, it's humans against alien creatures. With uh, presumably with guns and things. Okay. In, like a sci fi kind of thing. Okay. That sounds cool. Was it. Uh, was it not they do they uh they messed it up did they okay um but yeah it's life treating you kenny i hope you're well yeah no indeed so the the material is called uh duct tape because it's what you use to seal ducts right seven but there was also a brand of duct tape called duct tape which is uh, like a, a 
a decent quality of brand, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong there, Seven. Um, oh, you just, you just put three years into Final Fantasy XI as well. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, yeah. They, uh, so they cancelled it because too few players. That's the only problem. It's quite the... It's a commitment, isn't it, to get people on an MMO that doesn't... Um, if you know, you could you could have the, the best game ever, but if people aren't playing it, what are they gonna do? Um, oh, so it was originally called Duct Tape. I, was, I didn't. I thought I always thought people were like uh, heathens. They were. Oh, I got some duct tape. I was like, open your ears. It's ducked. Turns out it's not. I was wrong all along. <laughs> oh, interesting. Yeah, glue on some duck cloth. Okay. How curious. Yeah, yeah. Well, la there you go. la de day. Learn something new every day. Especially with you ladies around. My God. Um, I appreciate it. God, I do. I do like. I do like learning things. I like people knowing stuff. It's uh, it's the best. Um. What's this? Wow. Um. Yeah. This. Look at this full story. Yeah. Daily Mail online. Uh. This is. This is this is this is some bullshit. Um, let me tell you, I can't believe it. you do find some interesting things. Um, daily fail. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it, I don't read. I, I, I don't read any of that uh, nonsense. Uh, af, you know. But uh, no, it's just an, a weird article written here. For uh, this is uh, yesterday uh, for uh, Daily Mail Australia. Uh, yeah, just to caught my eye. Why nobody should be using the thumbs up emoji in 2022. I was like, what? I, I use the thumbs up emoji all the time. Anyone got a problem with the thumbs up emoji? Um, where's it at? That. Uh, is, it, is anybody here in chat have a problem with that emoji? Answer the question. I've even got an emo of a guy giving the thumbs up. There we go. Is that apparently that's offensive now? Um. Uh, El Barzo. Uh, please tell me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you want the gladiators to kill each other? No, I thought I thought thumbs down was kill. The after the fight, thumbs up means don't kill him. I thought thumbs down meant kill that guy. He's no good. I don't want to see him fight again. This is uh, it's, it's interesting to me. Um, uh, math a pink. Uh, uh, is that saw? This game is going to be free and epic today, as in uh, Darkwood. No, I did not. That's okay. I own a copy, so it's fine. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's the other way round. I don't. I don't. Is that true? I don't know. Um, uh, it feels like it makes you dumber. Okay. Uh, that's that's interesting, El Barzo. Uh, I mean, I mean, if you if you have a open mind and you know you're a critical thinker, then you know no in, no amount of information should make you uh, feel dumber. I feel. Um, yes, today is the thirteenth. Uh, math pink. That is true. At one p.m. Which time zone? As I say, not an issue because I own the game. So it's not it's not really too much of an issue, is it? Um But yes, uh Yeah, uh But yeah, it's uh just curious. But I'm you know, let's let's see what it says. Um Sending a thumbs up can be seen as a passive aggressive and even confrontational uh, according to Gen Z. Who claim they feel attacked whenever it is used? Who 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 are they speaking to for this article? Um, a twenty-four-year-old on Reddit summed up the Gen Z argument, saying it's best never used in any situation, 
as it is, hurtful. Um, Can I sit here? Uh, yes, uh, Math. Uh, thank you. Thank you for following there. Um, uh, what is this nonsense? It's bad form. A thumbs up. That's like a polite thing to do. That's saying I agree with what you're saying. Um... I don't know why, but it seems a little bit hostile to me. <laughs> People are uh, far too sensitive nowadays. If I give you the... Th you guys, let me tell you right now. If I, I give you the thumbs up on stream or in person or as uh, an emoji, it is what it means. If, it, if I want to be aggressive with you, I'll be calling you up and I'll be getting up on your grill. You know, I don't do passive-aggressiveness. That's, that's for, that's for weak-ass little bitches. Um... I will be letting you know that you've pissed me off and that, you know, if we met in real life, I'd offer, you know, a little bit of fist fisticuffs with you. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. People um, people are a little bit uh, on the, you know, uh, a little bit sen too sensitive nowadays. Shouldn't be a heartless bastard. You've got to have emotions. You've got to care about people. But it's not like one extreme or the other. Um, but anyway... Uh, thank you, Matho. I appreciate that. You're not the first person to say that. Uh, that seems to be one of my better features, my eyeballs. Um, I, I, I prefer their uh, function over their form. But um, you know what I'm saying. Uh, <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, here's, here's my philosophy. Uh, maybe Seven will agree with this. Listen to everything. Believe nothing. Now, obviously, don't take it to that extreme because you can't obviously listen to everything because there's a lot of nonsense out there and it's a waste of your time. And if you believe nothing, then, of course, you, you, you just wander around in a day. not achieving anything. But you see what I'm saying? Uh, so I don't just ignore something uh, just because of the source. You know what I mean? I'll still pay attention. Everything comes with a sack of salt with me. I'm like, okay, you said this. Um, if I meet a person who says... Isnib, don't use the, a thumbs up emoji because that's offensive to me. I'll be like, you're, I will just I'll outright turn say to them, no, it's not. You're a little bitch. Go do some squats. You know what I mean? Go for a run. Sort your life out. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> Poops is like just to attack them. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> room temperature bar. <laughs> um, everyone's different regardless of their age. You know, I know uh, I know people who are teenagers who are badass motherfuckers. I know people who are in their 60s and 70s who are weak-ass little bitches. Uh, it, you know, everyone's different. But, um, yeah, if, if, you, if any if you, in, individual human being comes to me and says, yo, don't use the thumbs up emoji because that's offensive, I'm going to be like, offensive to who? Offensive to you? Well, you're shit. You are just shit. Sort your, sort your, go sort your life out. Um, <laughs> you see what I'm saying? If I, if there's an emoji like that, that's offensive. That's offensive. We all know what that means. That's offensive, right? Do you know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, don't don't use that at people. But that that means I agree with you. That means good job. That means we're we're friends. Sort your life out. Um, <laughs> uh. Yeah, I, I feel generally, generally, Af. People th say the world is in a bad place nowadays. And, you know, if uh, Russia do decide to start slinging nukes around, maybe we might, you know, things might get a bit wild, uh, to say the least. But um, on a general timeline of humanity, things are better. They are. They really are for everybody. Um, Red Mage! Arr, how you doing, matey? Uh, <laughs> um, what are you doing, Red Mage? Red Mage, if I give you the thumbs up, like, yo, Red Mage, or you share something on uh, the like on the the conflux, like the, the fact that uh, the first episode of the new Bleach is ten out of ten, and I and I give it a thumbs up reaction. 
what do you feel about that red mage are you uh are you are you like oh his name's being passive aggressive to me <laughs> or you, I, I don't know anyway but yes uh <laughs> fair enough Atheline there lovely Atheline without a doubt over nine thousand aren't you my dear i hope <laughs> i appreciate that um i don't know maybe 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 af's trying to catch up with you red mage or just stay ahead of you i don't know where we're at but let's see where you guys are at you're both up there yeah yeah she did not want to be overtaken by you uh red mage boom thank you af uh <laughs> she's look red mage she's just trying to stay on top of you all right you don't mind that af's right directly on top of your deal ryan Ooh. uh yeah very much so ryan i would say already got um already got a beautiful eyes compliment so that's that's good scotty look scotty look yeah live long i do that live long and prosper oh that's offensive to me that's that's passive aggressive you're telling me what to do <laughs> I'm telling you to have a long life and a good life. Don't tell me what to do. Um, what what is the world coming to, folks? <laughs> um, how you doing? How you doing, Scotty? Uh, yeah, and I mean that—that's just Scotty saying he wants he wants to finger me. Um, and uh, you know, tickle my uh hanging parts. Um, that's that's all he's saying there. Um, uh hair appointment excellent how did it go ryan are you a, a trim yeah you said i think you said yesterday you're a bit wild man at the minute um ryan you're looking good we well, don't have to show us what you're looking like but i'd be happy to stick it in my special little folder you know what i'm saying uh <laughs> um yeah we're just rambling uh ryan so don't worry um uh in a cancer ward uh, all right, because it's live long and prosper. Yeah, I mean, if you've got people who are, like, terminally ill, say, going up to them saying, I hope you have a long life, could be a little bit, you know, maybe that's not the way to go. Uh, Legion Cage, what the fuck is Darkwood? I don't know. I don't know, Legion Cage. We'll find out together, won't we, shortly. Um, Slate Mick, I don't know. You tell me. Um, yeah, exactly. I, th I know, Scotty. I know you. I know you. Um... But uh, I... <laughs> please do, Ryan, you handsome devil. Um, um, yeah. I mean, it depends. It depends in what uh, in what context, doesn't it? It's how it's said. If you like go up to a terminally ill person, you're like, I'm really sorry that you're dealing with this, and I hope things get better. I, I hope your last days are not too unpleasant. That's meaningful. Uh, you know that that's worthwhile. But if you're like, hey, bro, I hope you have a good long life. <laughs> yeah, no, that's maybe not, is it? Uh, <laughs> you do like, you call a doody there, Red Mage. Um, that's what I do best, Cage. Out, Cage, how was uh, California? Did you have a good time? Um, excellent. Yeah, yeah. So Darkwood is a, a top down indie survival horror game. Uh, Cage gifted to us by one of our producers and voted on by one of our producers it, it, and appropriate because it's the horror -y season um we just had a uh, math pink and el barzo just step in because we're we're playing darkwood so there we go apparently it's, apparently it's free today on epic uh on epic games so pick it up v weird coincidence uh, i don't need to do that i don't like the free games on epic because obviously you have to use their their like app <laughs> it's weird though isn't it um yeah <laughs> are you just being funny seven Ma yeah markiplier is a relative relatively big name in youtube and streaming i believe uh been around the block a few times um don't, but then again i don't actually know anything about them i assume it's a guy whose name is mark uh and you know likes to Applier things. Um, 
th yeah, this is what I've just been told uh, in, in three hours' time. How random. So, if, yeah, guys, if you like what you see today, you can pick up the game yourself for free. Um, it, to be fair, it was when it was gifted to me, it was not an expensive game. So, you know, it's not like that, that producer's lost too much. Um, yeah, it's because there's too many games. I used to do this, Seven, on uh, when I was games with gold on Xbox. You'd get like X free games every couple of months, and I'd every month or so, and I'd um, like download the games. And my brother's like, Why are you downloading that trash? I'm like, Because it's free. He's like, You're never going to play it. I was like, That's not the point. <laughs> and it's like, it, it's like, you're just wasting your life. Wait, don't do that. Um. <laughs> um. Uh, excellent. Excellent. Great personality goes a long way. Um. Coffee done. That down there out of the way. Um, what else do I need to r rabbit about, guys? Do you tell me um, before we get into Darkwood? Um, I haven't set up a scene for it yet, but we'll, all right. we'll do that as we go along. Um, ah, okay. You just you can add them to your library cage without downloading them, so you can download them anytime in the future. Good thinking, sir. Um, um. Interesting, interesting case. I didn't know that, but still, it's like even going to that effort. I don't know. It seems a bit much. Um, um, uh, installation L Bart. So you mean of uh, of Darkwood? I don't know. What if I downloaded the other day? <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> uh, seven. Hang in there. You're doing fine, my dear. Uh, just don't. Just, <laughs> just uh. Don't uh don't pay attention. If you see, you see something that is uh not to your liking, just ignore. Um. Anyway, I think we should get into it. So I'm quite excited about this. I don't know anything about it. Um. Thank you all for being here. Um. <clears throat> um. I hope you all. Yeah. Cage. Uh. Yeah. I hope you had a good time in uh, California. I'm. But you, you you sling me a message, buddy. Obviously, uh, it's Thursday today. That's a planned days. If that still works for you, don't expect you to commit to next Thursday. But as soon as you're ready, Cage, you let me know. We can go and get started on Lone Wolf. No rush, though. We've got plenty of other stuff to do. Um, so, yeah, let's uh, build a scene. Let's get the game open and get this sorted out. I hope it's got controller support. I'd be shocked if it didn't. Um, I don't know how I feel about that cam there. Let me tidy that up a little bit. Uh, no, I don't mean it's too big, do we? Yeah, drop me down slightly. There we go. That's all right. That works. Um, here we go. I hope it's not one of those games that's like super loud and you have to immediately jump into the... Uh, the volume, the sound settings, and turn it down. Here we go. Darkwood. Let's check it. Okay, sorry. Of course, it's got an update. Never mind. <laughs> um, so, Ryan is uh, has played this, I know. Um, so, hopefully, if I, you can give me some advice if I need it, Ryan. Trying to sort itself out. And I don't know if this is going to be... I might want to stuff my face in the other corner or something. We'll see how it goes. Uh, in fact, I th I'm already thinking. Uh, stick myself over here. We got that to start with. <clears throat> um. Sorry, I should have. Uh, I should have tried running the game before. Uh, Let's jump back here for a minute. <laughs> There's a black screen. Uh, <laughs> um, could you not see me, Af? There you go. We'll jump back over for a minute. Root! How you doing, Root? Are you well? My God, Root. Thank you for sharing your hair 
uh, with us yesterday on the conflux. Banging that orange, my God, so vivid. And nice ink as well, Root. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, yeah, how you doing, Root? Are you well? Oh, I think we're in the game now. Okay. I'm going to... Okay, let me get to... Okay, it does have control support. Let me... Uh, audio... Just move my freaking oh okay I can't even use the mouse. I oh, can. There we go. <laughs> Apply. There we go. Let me uh let me show you guys what I'm doing. That would be more helpful, wouldn't it? Um. Try not. Yeah. Allergies win. Here we go. Let me uh. uh game capture. Um, there we go. We're good to go. I think we're good to go now, folks. Uh, <clears throat> try not let your allergies win, Root. I'm sorry to, um, yeah, Jimmy Carr, not quite as good. A little bit, a little bit. <laughs> uh, yeah, not. Uh, I don't think I quite. Ha I'm up to his standards, but uh, here we go. Um, all right, let's let me try and get through these options. Uh, okay, so I think I've balanced out the music a little bit. Okay, so st stick to move. He's probably going to tell us, isn't it? So right shoulder button is it an action. Left trigger to aim. Okay, I'm not trying to yeah, revert to default. You know what I mean? I'm just going to dive into the game and we'll see if we can figure it out. Uh, audio is fine. Resolution is fine. Full screen. Uh, I guess all of that stuff is fine as it is. Let's play. New profile. Uh, difficulty. Normal, I guess. The forgiving mode. When dying, you drop a part of your equipment. Hard. You have a limited number of lives after that is game over. Nightmare. Pe death. Permadeath. Okay, well, so we don't know what the bloody hell is going on. I'll just put it on normal for now. Maybe it would be to feel like it's too easy and we can play it on... A diff no, a, a more, you know, higher difficulty setting, I don't know, but... Let's go normal to start with. No, it just says it's not easy. It's just normal. Sorry, let me, uh... Let's get my chat over here a little bit. Um... <clears throat> Uh, you're getting more tat you're getting more ink tomorrow, Root. My God. Jelly. Enjoy. Look forward to seeing it. Um, yeah, do not skip the prologue. We don't want to do that. I want to know what the hell is going on. Uh, Indiegogo content. This option enables additional cool, but immersion-breaking content. I'll turn that off, then. I want to be immersed in the game. I'd rather have less content and it makes sense. Okay, I think I'm good to go then. Yeah, play. Yeah, that's all set up, isn't it? Okay, let's go. Let's find out what was going on. Playing challenging and unforgiving game. You will not be led by the hand. Respect the woods. Be patient. Focus. Oh dear. I've got to. I've got to be patient and pay attention. Oh my god. We're screwed already. Uh. <laughs> Prologue. Excellent. Do tell me what's going on. I see hatred and fear in their eyes. That's not... That's not good. As if I was responsible for the spreading disease. That's not good. No, don't, don't blame people who are not... Uh, not responsible. As if I were the source of all the misery plaguing this land. Damn. Things are not good. 
I have nowhere to hide from them, nowhere to run. The woods have closed us off from the outside world. Oh dear. <laughs> Excellent, Seven. We are all doomed. That's not good. This, this, is, the, this is the start, folks. What's going on in this game? Are we all doomed? Okay, cool. Here's our little guy. Oh, okay. There's lots, oh my god, there's lots of things going on. Examine some potatoes. I don't have any skills to use yet. Okay. Um. Oh, I'm... Ah, uh, okay. So B is... Uh... Oh my god, I probably should look at the controls. I wonder if this might be easier. Alcohol distiller. I can examine that. Okay. Okay, so A is like looking at... Uh, that's when he's popping up. You don't have any skills. And he seems to be searching there. That's B. So Y. Okay. And uh, D-pad is scrolling through that stuff on the top left there. One, two, three. Uh, We need to drag our chair around. Right, search the desk. The table. Yeah, I don't know what, what he's doing there. Okay, nothing in it. Okay, um. Now, do you need skills to examine medical notes? Maybe you do. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, right, there you go. That seems to be the. Maybe we'll activate there, so I'll examine it. Uh, I know these notes by heart. I don't want to read them now. Uh, a homemade device pr producing moonshine. Okay, that's... Potatoes. Make a moonshine. The only edible thing growing on this land. I still have some left. I'm too far. No, you're not. Okay. That's whatever it says on... Uh... There we go. Okay, here we go. So it's right bumper to look... Like, look at the stuff. So, you've got pills, uh, value 30, max 3, notepad, my old notepad, value 1. Okay, well, take all. Okay. Can we draw a, something on it? No, okay. I guess not. Never mind. Um... Okay, I guess we're going to head outside. Oh. The generator's almost out of juice. I need to find a full gasoline can. I saw a broken tractor to the east. Maybe I can find some gasoline there. Oh my god, this is... Uh, <laughs> um, it's, it's hard, is it? Ryan, okay, let's, I'm glad we're playing normal. Uh, anyway, Squidge, thank you for the lurk. I know this is not your jam, so I don't want to show you scary things. Uh, Root, thank you for the lurk. You go walk uh, Raven and uh, get on your meeting. Um, Ryan, get on your phone call. Uh, Bio! How you doing, Bio? Are you well, buddy? Sorry if I kept you waiting there for a second. Oh, what's going on here? A camera. My old Zenit camera. Medical bag. My old useless medical bag. I don't know. And a photo. Oh, that doesn't look good okay interesting shoes nothing in the shoes <laughs> oh barricaded window I think so I don't really want to dismantle that right cage this time they're empty Let's search the cage okay nothing in it how you doing, bio? Are you well? Um, yeah, <laughs> a disused medical bag. Yeah, I mean, it seems like yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Let me smash the door in like that. Okay, so I'm I'm guessing if we look in the top left there, we've got that red bar. I'll get that's your health. Um. And I bet uh, it seems like maybe the grey silvery bar is your, like, stamina, maybe? Oh, what the hell was that? 
my bed to examine. I've just woken up. It's not much of a bed, is it? This radio has been silent for years, although sometimes I can hear voices through the static. That's slightly disturbing. Barricaded window. More medical notes. I know these notes by heart. I don't need to want to read them now. I best not enter this room right now. Okay. Oh, okay. We've got a bunch of stuff here. Um, alcohol. I guess uh, that's making moonshine rags. That's going to be like crafting stuff, isn't it? I maybe I don't need to take all this. Ah, okay, key. It'll open the front door to my house with this. Okay, cool. Medical book. Okay, this... These people don't look too healthy, do they? A matchstick. Good for lighting fires. Oh, I wonder if we can make molotovs. Alcohol, rag, and a, uh, a match. Maybe, I don't know. And boards. I guess that's for boarding up windows. Lamp. I'm going to switch on and off. Okay, I don't know. Maybe if you want to save electricity. I don't know. Um, yeah, how's life treating you, bio? You're working from home today. Nice. Uh, but I'm very well, buddy. I'm very well. Uh, it's quite a puzzler. Yeah. I don't... I have no idea what to expect with it. Random container. The uh, locker's jammed a long time ago. Never mind. I used to keep useless, useless junk in there anyway. I could open it with a lockpick. I do not currently have a lockpick, I believe. Um. Rather not open it. I spent too much time to lock him in there. Sorry, somebody's locked in there. That's uh, a problem, no? Let's turn the lights off if we're going out, yeah? Maybe. Right, okay. So we've got our key. Uh, here we go. Uh, plus icon X2. You can hold right shoulder to open the selected object's uh, action menu. Cool. Yeah, there you go. So you could... Uh... Ah, okay, and that's where it's like. So open or barricade the door. So you want to... Ah. Open, use key. Perfect. There we go. Wow, well, can I uh, lock the door? No, it stays. Uh, it stays unlocked. Okay, so we've got a wrecked car there. Uh, it used to be a luxury, but since all the access roads have been devoured by the woods, it became a useless pile of trash. What is going on in this game? This is it seems sus. What is going on with that poor doggo over there? My dog. I don't think he's going to make it. I should end his suffering. Um. Yeah, we probably should. Look at the state of him. He's all beat up. He's got. F we should kill that dog right now. How do I? How do I do that? I'm not sure. Destroyed well. Rope. Oh, the People's Tribune. Daily newspaper of the Polish People's Republic. Okay. Um, I cannot read Polish, though. That's, um... That's the only thing. Uh... Oh, press Y to vault over obstacles. I don't... I don't already don't like that the dog goes in pain, there. What are you going to do? Wood logs. A nail and boards. Okay. Okay, looks like this is a dead end over here. Oh yeah, that's your stamina. Okay, so you if you walk f a full tilt, your stamina goes down. If you walk slowly, it doesn't. A large humanoid doll with a carved out face. Okay, that's slightly disturbing. Right, okay, so this is our base, I guess. 
You got to, you've got to find something to help or put Doggo out of his misery. Now, I assume you don't. I assume you don't uh, save your game, do you? You just go and then you either you die and then you deal with the consequences. <laughs> um, I'm not left it to die. I'm trying to kill it. Look at the state of it, Cage. I've, that doggo is not going to make it. I need to put it out of its misery. But I have no nothing to do. To, 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 no weapon or anything to send it on its way. Do you know what I mean? So... Oh. We got an axe. Maybe I can axe it. Oh my god. Poor doggo. Um, okay, I guess... How do I... Oh, here we go. Oh! Your position on the map is not marked. When you discover a new location, it will be added to your map. The location you're currently in is located in re indicated in red. In order to not get lost, you need to learn how to determine your position relative to the discovered locations and landmarks. Okay, that's cool. I can, um... I can do that. That's our map. That's where we are at the minute. Um... God, this is really... This whole thing's a vibe, isn't it? Um... Uh, yeah, so I, I seemingly at the minute I can't like equip the axe or use it. Guess we're just taking it for now. Um, yeah, boy, I don't. Uh, it seems intriguing to say the least. Okay, it was telling me. With the weapon selected in your hot bar, hold left trigger to take aim, then press right shoulder. Okay, cool. So how do I... Uh... Put a weapon in the hot bar? That's the question, isn't it? Okay, let's look, look around there. Um... Not on the map, obviously. Um... Oh, there you go. Press B to sort through your stuff. Okay, so I'll go to Axe. Transfer to the hot bar. No. Um, pick up. Okay, how to put an our axe? Uh, transfer drop. Uh, ah, hang on. Ah, there you go. I have to pick it up and place it in the hot bar. There we go. Yeah. Uh, okay, we've got our axe now. Cool, cool, cool. Right, I see. God, that's rather loud, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, is our axe smashed up now? I want to see if I can axe Doggo. Do look away if you're sensitive to Doggo murder. <coughs> Poor thing. Couldn't leave it like that, could I? Um, life's pretty dandy. Level of fitness. Well, bio. Respect you, sir. I respect that a lot. Um, good on you. We'll chop up that little wooden doll. I guess if if you need if you need wood, poor doggo. Never mind. Okay, I'm slow. Yeah. So B to access your inventory. Drag the axe. Yeah. Okay. I'm slowly figuring this out, folks. Uh, these trees are growing too fast. Soon I won't be able to cut them down fast enough. A bear trap. Uh, snare traps. I must be careful. The woods are full of them. Can we take it with us? We can, but we're almost like full of stuff. So, um... I think you're better off... Uh, I don't know what pills do. That's probably heals, right? Uh, oh, hang on. Let me try something. 
Okay, I don't know if I could put the pills in the medical bag. Scrap metal. Okay. Um. Okay, I'll put the pills there. So I can use them. I assume that's what they're for. Um. Dead cow. A bone. Okay. I guess we'll take that. Uh, I am going to go back to my house and stash this stuff because our inventory is very quickly getting filled up. Where's our uh, stash bottle? Oh. There we go. So let's... Um, um, Okay, how do I, um... Drag. Search it. No, I'll, 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 I guess I, I mean, I'm trying to search it, but I'm trying to put... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, okay, cool, I've got it. Sorry about this. <laughs> uh, so, we'll slash our boards. And nail. Um... Scrap metal. And a bone, uh, the medical bag, and uh, alcohol, rags, and rope. Okay. Let me. Uh... Oh, yes, yeah, so we have to lockpick this one, don't we? Yes. Can't do that. Oh, d Ooh, okay. My tools. They haven't been sterilized for years. The local patients can't be helped anyway. Right, so the vibe I'm getting is been some kind of like crazy disease and everyone's screwed and it's like been literally going on for years. And this guy is maybe some kind of doctor or the best they've got of a doctor. Uh, you know what? I might hang on to the matches for a minute just because... I might need to actually use them for something. I don't know. Anyway. Right, let's go. Uh, Slink Mick, how you doing, buddy? Um, Phoenix down. Let's see. He, he was not in good condition, we'll see. Let's be honest. Location found. Path. Oh, we're going off the beaten track, are we? Oh, no. We're not. This is just the... the, the this is the location. <laughs> the woods have devoured all the roads that connected us to the outside world. No one is able to pass through this thicket. Oh, God. So it's not only like some kind of virus or illness... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> turn the sound down slightly up, I think. Oh. There we go. Um, but also the woods have grown like crazy. Like evil woods, maybe. I don't know. Um, you got a head cold? Ah, Yeah, you're alive though, Slick Mick. That's what matters, isn't it, buddy? Alright, fallen tree. Okay. Looks like that's the exit. I guess we look around here. Okay, unless... Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything here. Burned campfire. Oh... I guess we want to take all of that, don't we? These parts of the woods are dark. I should craft a torch. 
Oh, okay. Crafting menu. You uh, needs one wood, one rag, uh, some kind of yeah, po point three of gasoline, and uh, one match. Oh, maybe there's gas in my car. Maybe that was it, and I missed it. Oh, this guy's stamina is terrible. Did I not um examine? Maybe not then. I wonder if maybe I can use the the alcohol to do something with it. Wonder. Um Aha, yes, we can. We can, cool. There we go, we crafted a torch. Excellent, so I guess... Why he needs a torch if he's got his, his actual flashlight? I don't, you know what I mean? I don't know. But, um... There we go, so if I get into the inventory... And get a torch... And... Put it there. I guess maybe I don't want to have it out while I'm wandering around. So it might, I guess it's it's got a certain amount of use to it. It's not infinite. Welcome back, Ryan. Um, yeah, no, indeed. Yeah. Yeah, I've got it, Ryan. Thank you, though. So maybe that's the benefit of a torch you can maybe see around you a little bit better i don't think there's anything there Right, okay, let's pull out our torch now. There we go. We've still got a flashlight, though. That seems weird. Okay, so we've got a fence there. So I think we're, like, roughly around there now, right? Yeah, band. There you go, abandoned farmhouse. Okay. I wonder it's abandoned. There's nothing freaking left of it. Whatever. Uh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh. Corpse. In a few days, it will be completely absorbed. Oh dear. Uh, yeah, something's going to kick off in a minute, Scotty. I don't know. Um, I'm not gonna. I don't feel like I'm fully uh, in tune with the controls yet. I'm just going to panic, and I'm just going to be like, "Oh no!" and just get killed. <laughs> Which would be somewhat anticlimactic, but uh, so be it. Uh, Sween, how you doing, Sween? Are you well? I'm getting lots of uh, cloth and stuff. 
All right, doorway repair. I don't know that we need to repair any of this. Seems um seems a bit uh redundant. Okay, moving on. I don't think there's anything down here. Oh. There is, but maybe not actually. Okay, now it's just the edge, isn't it? Which is like under the uh, overhang of the trees. Well, the v I'll tell you this for a start. The vibe. I like the vibe. Uh, very much so. You're still homesick, are you, Swing? Well, I'm sorry that you're ill, but um, also, uh, you know, nice to be at home. I guess you'd rather be at work and not, not be ill, but. Oh, uh, okay, this is water. Okay. Let's get my feet wet for a minute. That's fine. At least we can walk through it. It's not, I'm not going for a swim. Oh, I think this one's still breathing. Oh my god. Unconscious man. Uh, Can I do anything to help him? Oh, big metal key. If there's an exit out of these woods, this key will surely open it. I should steal this from this guy. 21. Oh. Hey, buddy. I know you're not dead, but I'm just going to pickpocket you. He's unconscious. I've never seen him around here before. He's only carrying a key and some journal. Okay, we're taking him back home, are we? Since he managed to sneak in here, he must know how to get out. Of course, he won't help me voluntarily. Oh, my God. But that... Is of no importance. Sorry, is our character like some kind of weird psycho? <laughs> uh, you still working from home, Sween? Oh my god, Sween. I'm sorry to hear that. I need to get out of this accursed forest. So that's our mission for us to escape, I guess. You hear me, rat. Show me how and I will let you go. What? Uh... <laughs> Yeah, Metapod, thank you for stopping. It is very... I don't know what... We have no idea what's going on. It's dark as all hell. It's like something... She's calling me. Calling me to return home. I hope you're well anyway, Meta. Yeah, Squidge has had to duck out. She's like, I can't deal with this. Where is the exit? Where? Oh, my God, tie this dude up. Show me where. This is kind of dark. I'll kill you like a dog if I have to. No, we killed that dog. We killed the doggo because the doggo was in pain. And now we're just beating up some random guy we found in the woods. Who Who even are we? <laughs> what? What is going on? Oh. Oh, wait. Are we playing as the, the guy now? That fucker stole my key. Oh, oh wow. Talk about twist. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Okay, so we were playing as some weird, slightly psychopathic um, medical doctor who's been surviving somehow in the woods for ages. And we found this random guy in the woods, which he's taken, he, he took back to his house. Not to help to steal his key, steal his notebook, his journal, and then punch him in the face a bunch. What on earth is going on? <laughs> anyway, I hope you're right, Matt. This you I we have I've I I take no responsibility for anything anything anyone is about to see here because I do not know this game at all. Um Oh my god. Look, you're, you're far braver than I am, uh, Ryan, so don't worry about that. But if anyone is interested, apparently this is free today in a few hours on uh, on uh, on Epic Game Store. There we go. So he's an entry to small... Uh, maybe the pantry. Can I open the pick? Right, yes, he's trapped us in... 
Oh, it's got wire and rags. Okay. Right, this barricade is too strong to dismantle. Now, I can't... Ah. Bandages. Use, use to heal wounds. Stops bleeding. Oh, okay, cool. So let's craft a bandage to heal us. So you punch, you know, punch it in the face a bunch. Um, and then we can... Yeah, so you go. For, if you have two wire, you can make a lockpick. Cool. Okay, so... Um, if I take the bandage... Ooh, sorry, I'm still getting used to the controls here, folks. And I'll take, oh, take the lockpick. Put that there. All right, so we... Uh, Oh. Yeah. There you go. Put a little bandage on his arm. He's got a slow tick regen there. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Use lockpick. Perfect. That right, bandage seems to be... It's slow, but it seems to be getting there. Um, what have we got? A shovel. It's heavy, but it has a good reach. I'm going to whack that guy with that. Uh, and a flashlight. Excellent. I clearly need both of these, don't I? So, do we not have the flashlight, though? Do you know what I mean? Like, how is that flashlight different to the flashlight we currently have? Unless that's not a flashlight that we have. You know, that's just kind of meant to be, represent our visual perception. Um. Yeah, no, of course. It's very dark metal. Thank you for stopping in, buddy. Uh, we will. I'm always here if you need me. Uh, but, uh. But thank you for stopping in, bud. I don't want to subject you to awful, scary things. So don't uh, don't feel the need to stay. You go, you go enjoy your day, bud. Okay. Interesting. So I guess that does represent your visual perception. What you can see there. It's not a flashlight. That is a flashlight. Right, okay. It's too strong to dismantle. I guess we've just got to smash the door down then. Um. Hello. Okay, our... Oh, what the... F what the fuck is going on here? Okay, lamp's not working. What's that? Oh, of course, there's a, there's a door back here, isn't there? Oh my god. Right, the generator doesn't work. So, how long have we been there? A metal table with leather belt strapped on. This is where he's doing his crazy experiments, hasn't he? So maybe if I dismantle these boarded up windows, I can get out the back of the house, but we'll see. Let's just have keep having a little gander around first. All right, some gasoline and a table leg made of oak. I could use it as a weapon. Okay. I think we'll, uh, we'll need to really, won't we? Okay, so before I start smashing down any uh, windows. Um. Sorry, what? The corpse has two dials instead of eyes. His mouth is wide open and I can hear a distorted noise, barely distinguishable from the radio static. Turn on the generator, turn on the generator.
This is um this is slightly disturbing, to say the least. Right, we've got a syringe. Oh, is that a key item? Assuming we've taken it, but Is he keeping people in these cages? Oh. Who's there? Is there somebody locked in there? Please let me out. I need to find the code. Unfortunately, we can't speak to them through the door. Oh my god. Um. Okay, I think maybe we need to try and head out this way. Let me see if we can smash this door down. Doesn't look like we can. I'm assuming that bar at the bottom there is its like health bar. Oh my god, this is um atmospheric to say the least. Oh my god. Um There's the generator. We can turn it on now, can we? Ah, uh, refill the generator. Equip the gasoline can. Uh, left trigger and right shoulder. Okay. Um. Guess we should fill it up. Oh, we used to, we used it all. Okay, cool. There we go. Weird. Oh. oh God, it's all very uh, disturbing. Okay, so I've turned the generator on. As as the corpse has advised us. <laughs> um Oh. Oh, four eight nine two is coming over the corpse radio. Okay. Four eight nine two. Door seems stuck. I need to apply some force to it. Seemingly. Oh, there we go. Help me. Okay. Oh! <laughs> it's that freaking bro, isn't it? My God. The only way we got through that is because I had a, a, a table leg and he had a, his fist. That was just, that was the guy who kidnapped us, wasn't it? The crazy doctor. He's dead. Plastic plastic chick. A small plastic chick. What the, oh, okay. Hello. 
Um, what is going on, Ryan? What is going on? <laughs> so he... W so... So... So he was trapped in his own room there. And he was the one going... Saying, oh, wh who's there? Help me. And then as soon as we break through the door, he's uh, attacks us. Oh, and how do you want... I think you can manage all by yourself. Who's saying that? I hear something. This is uh, disturbing. I'll just, <laughs> I'll just turn the audio down slightly. This a bit on the loud side, I feel. Right, okay. Oh, what the? Oh, we've got freaking... Was that... What was that? Zombies? Forest zombies? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Aye, aye, aye. This is, uh... This is very disturbing. I like it. Um... Holy hell. That's the prologue. I guess it's introduced us to the game. Now we get into the main game. Chapter 1. Ay, ay, ay. Now, are we the same guy? We're in the same outfit. So maybe that didn't really happen. Or maybe it did. Um, okay. Yeah, it's got the same crafting menu. But we don't have any items. Okay. Okay, so we're in a completely different place here. Okay. A pleasant warmth is emanating from the oven. Like it's a strange yet familiar scent. It's a smell of the protective substance. Which gives me relative safety after dark. Uh, the vapours rising from the huge cauldron are distributed all over the house via long pipes. As long as I remain inside my hideout, I have a chance of surviving the night. Okay, so we've got some kind of... I'm going to set up here. There seems to be some, either some kind of heated chemicals. Gives us some kind of vapour that keeps the darkness at bay or the evil at bay. Uh, examine the oven. When I arrived here a couple of days ago, the oven was basically prepared. I just needed to light it up to ensure my safety at night. This cottage must have been one of our hideouts. The inhabitants of these woods don't need to inhale this revolting gas. Uh, okay. Interesting. Look at the bottle. The label on the bottle says, Staying out of the reach of the protective substance after nightfall results in immediate death. 99 out of 100 cases. It is advised to evenly spread the gas inside the sleeping area. Okay, so, and so you can go outside at daytime. At nighttime, you have to be near this gas. So I wonder if you can get this gas as a portable thing, but um, I don't know. I'll have to wait and see. Warning: even a properly prepared substance does not guarantee one hundred percent safety. Remain vigilant. It is recommended to stay in well-lit indoors areas in order to minimise the risk. Wow, this is... Yeah, look inside the pot. Okay. A small, empty, cast iron pot. I haven't used it yet. I haven't felt any uh, hunger or thirst since the accident a few days ago. I can't stop thinking about one thing. These mushrooms... They're red, pulsating mushrooms. They look so tasty. 
Maybe this pot will prove useful after all. Cook. We can cook something. Oh. So we can cook something to make some kind of medicine or a vaccine or something to the to fight the whatever is it the mushrooms we need for it either way we don't have anything at the moment this is very intriguing i'm going to just throw on a hoodie quickly because it's quite, it's kind of getting chilly in here but that's under part of it is the goosebumps i'm feeling <laughs> And to drink probably. I'm not trying to do um I'm not trying to do um what's his name? The Facebook guy. Uh anyway. One second. In fact, I probably need to pee, honestly. I'm just gonna put us on a sixty second break. I'll be right back, guys. Right, sorry to keep you waiting there, folks. Welcome back, Red Mage. Uh, I'm hooded up. I'm empty bladdered. I'm ready to get into the dark wood. My God, this is... <laughs> there we go. I love the fact that I don't see the icon when you switch between mouse and keyboard and controller. The controller is a SNES controller. Did you see that? Let's see if I do it again. Yeah, you see, look, mouse and keyboard down the bottom there. And I'll switch to controller. It's a SNES controller. Whoever made this game, they obviously uh, have good taste. Um, ben, it's, it's cold. I, I'm feeling the 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 chill. Af, this is true. Ben, how you doing? Yeah, dark wood. And the wood is dark. I don't know what's going on, Ben. I'm very scared though. Um, okay, so we can't turn. So it seems like whatever the evil is, we either need to. We've got this gas in this house. This is our little safe house. And we are... As long as we're in here at night time, we should be safe. We may be able to make some kind of medicine to, like, give us that same effect. So we can go out and about into the woods at night time, maybe. 
Um, but it did it, that little warning did say there's no guarantee anyway. Um, and the other thing seems to be light. The dark you can fight against the darkness with light, which seems obvious. But um, so that gas slash medicine and also using light. So the, the safest place is in this house with the lights on. Uh, but it looks like we do not have uh, any power at the minute because that lamp is not working. All right, so let's see, look around what we can find. So we've got uh, a photo of a ro the road. Uh, the road home. Uh, I'm going to say Droga Dodone. Dodone? I don't know what that means. Um... Okay, I don't know how that helps us necessarily. Uh, a, a rag and 11 nails. Okay, cool. Um, so if we find some wood, we can maybe board the windows up. Um, oh, that's a bl bloody hole in the wall there. Um, so let me uh, maybe put that there for now. Which is not perfect, obviously, but... better than a freaking hole in the wall um a right, random stool don't need that workbench use oh we use the workbench okay so you can uh level one workbench let's have a look let's see what we can do um uh it's obviously a beaver <laughs> i mean because <laughs> uh I oh, mean, it's it's been a while since I've uh, uh, had any, you know, close uh, encounters with any beavers. Um, yeah, Red Mage, it's, it's crazy. It's got got crafting and gathering system as well. So you can so you can make torches. Obviously, that gives us light. Uh, and you need basically wood, rags, some kind of fuel, and a match to make a torch. Makes sense. Bandages to heal yourself. Rags, two rags. Uh, wire can make lock picks. Uh, bandage with alcohol, good. For, ah, better for heavy wounds. So if you have alcohol and a bandage, that's better than a bandage without. Makes sense. Uh, a chain trap. I have to make traps. Oh my god. Um, scrap metal. Um, antidote, consumable, cures and protects against poison for a limited time. Is that a mushroom of some kind? Um, board with nails. A nail and board, and then we can whack those on the window, I guess. Hot bar upgrade. Uh, I need to upgrade my workshop to craft this. Either way, rope and some kind of cloth. <laughs> yeah, we definitely want a hot bar upgrade. Uh, inventory upgrade. We definitely want that as well. Interesting. Um, a bear trap. Trap for bears and other things. Uh, I need to upgrade the workshop. And gas bottle. Also need to upgrade the workshop. Um, a bottle filled with toxic gas and highly flammable. I need bottle and... Or another kind of a different kind of mushroom by the looks of it. Um, repair item upgrade item upgrade workshop. Right, okay. So I guess this is our base of operations. So de doing this is definitely going to be needed. Um, we've need ten nails, which we've got. We also need six wooden boards, which you do not have currently. Okay, that's our workbench. Looking forward to uh doing something with that so we've got one window that's barricaded there already and one that's barricaded there already a doorway to repair don't really have anything to repair that at the minute oh 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 no we're poisoned or something oh yeah we're, we've we're losing health we've got poisoned by those mushrooms there mushroom remains oh my god i can't do anything with those um, I think the poison's going to run its course. Yeah, it's like a debuff. It didn't do too much damage. Oh my god. Um. Uh. Right, that's not barricaded, that window. Alright, cook. We have nothing to cook at the minute. That's fine. Um. Right, we've got rope, alcohol, empty bottle, and mushroom book. All right, so look at this. Uh, title reads, The Use of Mushrooms in the Household. Maybe that gives me some recipes there. Right, a bear trap is sat there. Let's try not to walk in that. 
in front of a window that's not barricaded at the moment. Okay, that makes sense. Um, also, another window there. Bed. I need to sleep, I guess. We have no power. Okay. <sighs> right, okay. Um, I guess we want to head outside. And see what we can see. And then we don't... Oh, okay. My, uh... Oh, there we go. Eight. Oh, okay, there we go. So this is our new map here. And we're in the old woods. That's our house. Uh, we've got a little cross there directly to the south of us. I don't know how important that is to go there. Um... And that's our journal. So skills, me, tab, skills, nothing. Journal. Right, okay. Into these damn savages, everything should go smoothly. Right, 12th of September 1987. I don't remember anything since the attack on our camp. Somehow I'm wearing a coat. So I must have changed my clothes on my way here. I don't recognize myself anymore. I can barely hold this pencil. Has my body changed? I no longer feel hunger or thirst. What has happened to me? Uh, key to underground number 21. Ah, that's the key the old psycho took from us. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, uh, veg omelette recipe in the mushroom book. Let's hope so. Uh, Red Maze, I don't know where we're going to get any eggs from. Um, it can, as long as, you, yeah, it can, Ben, as long as you're not uh, rely on it too much to heal those inside boo boos. Um, how you doing, Ben? Are you well? Uh, yeah, I remember his face. The face of the man who saved me, then held me captive. I don't know how I managed to escape his hut uh, and end up here. Well, we remember. We don't, we don't know how he got here, but we, you know, we, ki we killed him because he attacked us. What I do know is that the insane fucker took my key. My only chance to get out of the woods is that tw number 21 key. He also tore out all of, sorry, all of the pages from my journal i doubt that he was able to learn the location of the underground passage uh, that's what we're looking for though i should check if the door is still locked just to be sure i must find him i don't think he still he still lives in the same place where he held me it makes no difference as i have no idea how to get back to that vile place day one nights i need to get back to my hideout before nightfall wandering here at night is too risky the forest exhibits increased activity after dark. Only the protective gas in my hideout could provide me with relative safety. Right, okay. Items. Ah, okay, and these are the... Uh, that's just a list. These are like the key items. Mushroom book, photo of a road, the plastic chick, and keys. We don't have any. Um, so in the very top left of the screen, you can see our little house, and there's that the moon behind it. I guess that's our day indicator well build need four wood okay that could be useful saw use uh convert wood logs to planks minus 70 fuel ah okay so that's how we so we need to go go find an axe go chopping some wood bring it here turn it into wooden planks to start building and upgrading stuff and barricading stuff um but we also need fuel uh, to, uh, to power it. Okay. Random locked container. Interesting. Right, okay, I, um, I mean, build a well. That, that well's done, done for. <laughs> Honest. Oh, here we go, wooden logs. They're not. Okay, that's actually a storage container. If you want to store your logs. Okay. Now, can I get these mushrooms without harvest? There we go. Don't walk into the mushrooms. Pick them up. Perfect. Odd looking mushroom. Got it. <laughs> uh... Cookable rots over time. Okay, so I guess once you've picked it, you need to uh, 
You do, in fact, need to cook it. The generator is half empty. It contains enough gasoline for one more night. I should find a full can in the house above the underground entrance. Okay. Uh, turn on the generator before dark. Hiding in the shadows won't do you any good. They're coming either way. Oh, my God. Okay, there we go. I've got a torch, some matches, and a rag. Okay. Now, do I actually... I've got a little bit of alcohol. But surely it's got to be actual gasoline, I assume. Okay, there we go. It's not night time yet, is it? So I probably want to be looking around. Let's see if I can find some stuff. Wow, there's nothing out here, is there? Oh my god. Um, you're tired, are you, Ben? I'm sorry to hear that, buddy. I, d I do all, all the time. It feels weird, like, wearing anything when you're trying to sleep. Okay, let's, I guess we got to the edge here. Location, Brook. Okay. Oh. Animal. Are you friendly? Oh. I'm gonna punch oh I can't punch it. I got no I got no weapon. Got nothing. Okay. Must run away from that wolf. Dog. Wild dog. Hound. That's a pain, isn't it? Um Yeah, I don't have anything I could even use as a weapon. I'm gonna use the torch. I would imagine not. Okay, can we get those mushrooms? Maybe not. That's a problem. Um Oh, God. Okay, they're not, like, super... They're, they're aggressive, but they're not, like... Track you down aggressive. Now, broken tree. Okay. But there's nothing out here. Um... Apart from wild dogs, I can't fend, fend off. Oh, and now I'm poisoned. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so it's going to run a course before it kills me. Um, I guess you also can't tell what time of day it is. Wait, so is it, is it night time now? Because I, I, it only gives you the time of day when you're at the house. I think maybe. Yeah, surely I'd be under attack, wouldn't I? Yeah, I can't. I can't really tell. Is that maybe? Is it? Are we daytime? Are we nighttime? I don't know. Um, I guess I should probably bandage myself though, right? Um, so what have I, what have I actually got at the minute? Okay, let me try and cook this mushroom. Once we've picked it up. So as it wet, it goes off at some point. There we go, mushroom. Oh. Ah, there we go. Essence, 10 out of 50. Dose one. Let's so we can step away from that and it's still there. Yeah, okay. So we need five of those little mushrooms to make a dose of mushroom power. 
Um, do you think so, Af? I don't think you can even actually sleep in the bed yet. No. So, just like a normal bandage can do you like about one and a half or even two. Uh. Even two like health blocks, maybe. Well, I've got. I can't just stay there. That's that's not gonna do anything, is it? Oh, here we go. Gasoline, nice. Rags, nails, wire. I think I should maybe use that gasoline to fill up the generator now. Might as well. There we go. So we've used it all, but the uh, the generator is now like almost full. So that should allow us to survive more than one night. Whenever night time is, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know when night time is going to be. Um, Underground entrance, which is the uh, the cross on the map there. I'm here. Yeah, dry meadow hideout, broken tree, the brook. Okay. So this is the where we need to find the key, um, I believe. Okay, some nails and a plank. Disarm that bear trap, take it with us. No point in being here. Cool. Nails and a plank. This is the house. I found the entrance to the underground here. Okay, cool. Cool. Bandage. I must return to your house before nightfall. Okay, so night's coming on. Let's just quickly get stuff out of here and then we'll uh, get out of here. Oh, fuck, Sank. That's my bear trap there. Um, is he automatically getting out? He is, okay. Let's scrap metal then. Okay, that doesn't work. So it's wardrobe. Pack of cigarettes. I don't know. That's a, a good thing, is it? Okay. Two full. Oh, no. Cause we could... Okay. Gross. Um, yeah, harvest the mushroom. Cool. Underground entrance. Oh. I thought this was the, the door that was locked. That we need the key for, right? Okay, or well, maybe not. Alright, interesting. Let's, yeah. Let's get back home. 
Because, uh, oh my god, is it already night time? It's not far off, is it? Let me um, pull out my torch, maybe. There we go. Yeah, it already feels darker, doesn't it? There we go. God, yeah, it's definitely... Okay, it's definitely night time. <laughs> Although, the, the, uh... The look of the, um... There we go. The look of the, um... What do you call it? Hopefully, uh, the little icon in the top left. It doesn't. It doesn't look like it's changed to me. Too dangerous cook during the night. Okay. So, um, what do you do? Just stand here. Yo, Sea Star! How you doing, Sea Star? Are you well? What's that? Oh, how's your how's your day going so far, my dear? I wonder if I should uh stash some stuff. I mean, I think you would go to bed during the night time, but. Oh, we got mushrooms randomly growing in the house. Is that what happens at night time? Oh. I think I'm supposed to do something, right? Okay, that doesn't sound good. Our Instagram reel. I'm so glad I don't mess around with Instagram. Um, I'm doing good. I'm doing very good, Sea Star. Playing this scary and weird as all bloody hell game. I, I honestly don't even know what's going on. Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, I think I think most people are alright. Some people are still a little bit ill. Swing's still a bit ill. Sleep mix not feeling the best. Um, you know, I don't want to speak for anybody else. But you know, I think you know everyone's like hanging in there as best they can. Yeah, the torch went out. Oh, I just used up my torch by accident. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm. Uh, I, I'm, I'm not someone who really gets scared very much. I know some people like Squidge is like making a point of not being here because she's not into scary games at all. Um, there's been a couple. There's been like at least one or a couple of like, oh my god, moments like. I, but yeah, I just want to say I'm scared, but I'm just um I'm just trying to figure it out. Uh the setting though is very weird and dark. Um I don't know what I'm supposed to do at night time though. Like just Literally just stand here and do nothing. I can't that can't be what the game wants you to do, right? That would be, that would be, that's like, it's kind of too crazy, do you know what I mean? Nope. 
you'd think like i would have thought it'd be kind of like assuming you've got like your generator up and running and everything's fine and you're safe you could just like dive into bed and be like okay now we just rest till morning but it doesn't seem like it wants to it seems like it's just i've just got to kind of just hang around for a bit going to put this in the other room so I'm not tripping over it oh oh wow outside is red now was that the dawn that was day two okay so the night seems to go quickly but it seems like you just have to um just hang around yeah the thing is Ryan I didn't seem like I had anything to do do you know what I mean? I've, I didn't have enough materials to craft anything. I've got nothing to do. Okay. <laughs> do you see what I'm saying? So, I don't know. Okay, well, at least I've got a gist of what is kind of going on. Um, I guess we're going to cook these mushrooms there. There we go. This mushroom. Okay, cool. Um, so, I probably want to store some of our junk, don't I? Can't really store much in there. Um, I might want to keep the lock pick just in case I stumble across uh, something that's locked. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I'll keep the bandage as well. Okay, so nothing came to get us, and I guess that's because we were uh That's because we had plenty of uh power to the generator. So let me uh refill it. With this ga other gas can we found. Excellent. Practically full now. Right, okay, so I've actually got a little time uh, icon at the top now. I don't know what that's all about. Um, so what should be the best thing to do? I guess we want to just explore the area, right? I'm just trying to look for stuff. We're still trying to get established at the minute. I need wooden planks. I need plenty of nails. I could. I'd love to have a weapon. That'd be that'd be pretty handy. <laughs> um. Uh, wrecked by league. Hello, hello there, wrecked. Uh, how you doing? Welcome in. Uh, yeah, me too. I have no idea what's going on or what we're supposed to be doing. Uh, <laughs> uh, basically, it's fun, though. And it is pretty scary. You're not wrong. What's this here? Oh. Oh, wait. I've got a freaking little maze going on here. That's so good, doesn't it? Uh, and what is the purpose of the maze? I don't know. Um, oh, it's just like a harvester. Seems to be. Uh, but welcome, welcome in there, Rekt. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on. Oh, oh, jeez. Why so aggro, doggo? It's changed up, chained up at least. Oh my god. Oh, sorry, wrong button. Okay, here we are. We're at the dry med, dry meadow. Is that? Is it? Oh, wedding, wedding. As in Reading Chapel, maybe. Okay, I can't. Maybe I'll just run by it. Or should I just risk running by it? Hey! Oh, okay. Um, let me check the table there. The 
stool. I'm trying to drag the table. Or the chair. Right, okay. Um, I don't know to make out any of this. Calm yourself, sir. It's hard to know, like, where or what, or where I'm at, or what uh, is that a del the kind of directly surrounding me? Does that make sense? Like I said, I've got some tables here. Are we, are we in a building right now? I assume we're in a building, right? And I assume now we're not. I don't know. Wagon. An old wagon decorated with colourful ribbons and flowers made of white tissue paper. Well, that's only good to anyone. Right, we've got some rope in the well. We'll take that. Uh. Okay, uh... I don't see a way through. Oh wait, hang on, a metal door. It's got a code, of course it has. One code. Okay. I don't know. I don't know the uh, I can get through this way. I think I have to get past that friggin' dog again. Okay, um, I don't, I don't even know what I'm looking for. I just need some, I just need supplies, don't I? I need to find anything, really, I feel. Stamina is terrible. He's, he's as bad as the old guy who tried to kill him. <laughs> oh, Wolf's Camp. Okay, I hope that doesn't mean there's actually wolves hanging around. Oh, it's a person. I can smell your stench from far away, meat. Um, he hello. Can we be friends? Yeah, Wolfman, talk. Oh, he's an actual wolf. What the friggin' hell? Even from afar, I smell your putrid stench. Be glad I don't have an appetite for carcasses, meat. The figure hides its face under the hood. It smells of wet soil and fur. I know what you're after. I can help you reclaim what you've lost if you help me attend to a certain matter. What do you say, comrade? As he leans towards me, I can hear him giggling under the hood. I knew it would interest you. Before we make a deal, you need to prove that you can do the job. Uh, I've no time for weaklings. Meet. You follow. Show me what you're made of. Get through to the get through to the silent forest. You think it's so easy? If I were you, I would prepare myself well before setting out. Uh, when you get there, you will find me in this spot. Remember it. Uh, the wolf grabs my map and scribbles something on it. The likes of you always call back to me. Right, okay. Show him an item. I'm showing the plastic chick. Beautiful item. Perfect for a church fair. Photo of the road. What's this you've got there? The wolf snatches the photograph from my hand and studies it carefully. And finally, he snorts. His thick yellow spit landing on the photo. Oh my god. 
Ha 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 ha! This road doesn't exist anymore. Overgrown with trees like all the other ones. The wolf... The wolf throws the photo to the ground. Better forget about the road home, meat. Around here, all the roads lead to nowhere. I guess I'll pick it, pick it back up. Trade. Oh. What's he got? He's got a toolbox. Right, reputation. So, 50 plus zero. So, I guess you can improve your reputation with him. Value. Right. Okay, so there's no money, of course. But you have to give him stuff that equals the value. So, like, a, for example, a lockpick has a value of 25. Bandage has a value of 30. Um, whereas, like, a board has a value of 3. And a nail has a value of 1. It's a toolbox for 200. Uh, battery for 50. A flare for 60. Okay, gasoline, 68. Oh, my God. Oh, small caliber magazine. We can get guns, can we? Handgun frame, 450. <laughs> Weapon parts, 450. Oh my God. Uh, a watch. Okay. Tape, metal pipe, chain. Wow. A red egg. An ordinary chicken egg. The only difference being that it's red. Okay, so we can, we're not in a position to trade any. We have no nothing to trade. If I you wouldn't venture too far from here unless you get bored of your lousy life meat. And if you return from the dense woods. And those who made it back were not able to share their happy stories. Okay, buddy. Any more coffee? Yeah, uh, and, uh, unless you get until you get a decent weapon. I wonder when you're wandering around these woods at night. It would mean certain death for you, mate. But hard enough, hide out of yours before dark and pray for the morning light. Okay. Right, a, wolf, a literal wolf man. Um, I assume it's not night time yet. Okay, so we've got someone we could trade with if I get stuff to trade with him, but for now, I can't really do too much of anything, I feel. Do I find things to pick up? Scavenge? Yeah, I want the toolbox. Yeah, I'll bet we do. I'll bet we do, Ryan. Just finding something uh, to trade for it. I don't want to go too far, because surely it'll be night time before long, right? Okay, because you can't pick up the poisonous mushrooms. That's just hazards to avoid. Oh, marked a little mushroom on the map, though. Oh, wait, hang on a second. It's a, the game's a little liar. It's playing games with us. Watch this. Unless... Oh, no, maybe not. I thought uh, I thought the, the cursor there, it said it doesn't show you where you are on the map, but I'm like, I'm, I figure we're roughly around here anyway. Okay, yeah, but now it's nowhere near. Okay, so it's not. It's not. I thought that was just, that was just a random coincidence, though. Yeah, we've got more uh, fields here. Aha, there we are. Is it time to head back now? Oh, disassembled tractor. Gasoline. Cool. We always need gasoline, right? Yeah, the burned house. Oh, yeah, just here, is it? Yeah, maybe we can have a look around this house, and then... There's not really much here, is there? It's wrecked. And then, uh... 
and head back for the evening. A flare and some rags. Okay. Out. The truck is here. It's locked. I need a key. Is somebody in there? No. There's people in there. Hello. Can we be friends? Oh, okay. I can't get through, seemingly. Destroy generator. Nails and gasoline. Right, okay. So it looks like to get into to that next section to the east, that large section, you have to go through this. Oh my god, poison myself, idiot. You have to go through this house, which requires a key to the burned house. Okay, well, in that case, let's um, let's go around the outside here and try and go back the way we came. Um, also, it can't be too far, too long before night time comes on, right? Unless maybe getting the watch tells you the time. Oh, uh, that would be pretty sweet. Tells you the specific... Oh, hello. That's probably going to whack us if we get too close to it. Oh, my God. Oh, dear. Oh, wait. I've got the freaking dogs again. Oh, my God. I wonder if it's like something in the air. This may, you know, means everyone has terrible stamina. Oh. to uh, attack can we yet? oh jeez there's a group of them there feasting on something okay we made it back to our house aye 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 I need to I need to all I need is an axe a wood axe to chop down some trees to make some planks so then I can repair the well I can upgrade the bench and I can barricade everything up in here that would uh, be, a, you know, a fair start. But, yeah. <laughs> right. Um, right, let's cook our mushroom. Okay, there we go. Oh, I've got a dose of what? Oh, these are like perks. Or am I just making this into a medicine? Be able to see further. Once a day, I'll be able to heal myself by standing next to an electric light source. Uh, once a day, I'll be able to learn my current location on the map. Hmm. I'll be able to heal myself by eating mushrooms. Staying in dark areas at night can be dangerous to me. In, no, no, sh no shizzle, Sherlock. I think of those. The see further ones probably the best, right? Oh, why am I double selecting that? I don't know. So I'll select one of these. I can't unselect that one. Let's go confirm. Okay, so we've got one dose. I don't know what that means. Um. There you go. Skills, shadows. So it's a bad skill and a good skill, an eagle eye. Not really getting it. Now, is it night time? I guess it is. Oh, wait. Did I not turn the generator off? Does the generator just turn itself on at night time? Oh, it's not night time yet, though. 
skull. I wish I, I wish I could have a uh, something to uh, tell me the time. Um, decent amount of uh, gasoline, though. Uh, I don't really need any of that, do I? Like, can you can't combine these, can you? You can. Excellent. Nice. Very nice. That's not the one I wanted to put in there, but never mind. There we go. So maybe I find this junk. I need to just kind of uh, trade it to the Wolfman. Um, So it seems my options at the minute. Well, I can't go this way until I find a key. I guess what I want to head down to the south there and check that entrance. Oh, there's another wolf's camp. Okay. Interesting. Uh, and the other option is to head to the underground entrance. Now, I thought it said to get into the underground entrance, you need the key. But maybe we entered it and we just didn't find the point where we can leave yet. But, um... How much time before the, the day is over? Is it still daytime? I guess it is, but how long before night time? Um, I, uh, I do not know. I wish we had a weapon. Some kind of weapon. And I'm sure, I, I would assume with the, uh, like that, the, um, where is it? The broken tree. I assume if I had an axe, I could have gone, could go and like chop that up a bit. Do you know what I mean? Get some wood from it. I'll just have a better. S I'll chop that tree down. You know, have a better scout around out here. Make sure I've not missed anything. It's very hard to know where you've uh, where you've been and where you have not been. if a bear trap's worth anything. Oh, okay, so disarming a bear trap, you just get scrap metal. You don't actually get the... Uh... Oh, you do not actually get the, uh, the bear trap itself. Okay, that's fine. Maybe that's how I start... Oh, hello. Maybe that's how I start making my money. Oh, here we go. Wire. Rags. More gasoline. Yeah, maybe that's how you make... I need to just kind of, like, pick up... Random scrap metal, whatever junk I can find, and go trade it to the Wolfman to get some of his actual useful stuff. Wish I need... Need the code for that. <laughs> I wonder what the benefit of the well is. I guess we'd have water, some access to some water. So, are you supposed to just tell the time of day by the, the quality of the light? Um, because it's kind of looking like an orange color, like it's uh, nighttime starting to come on. 
You can watch it. Yeah, look. You see it's going darker. Kind of. I think it seems to be. Yeah, it looks like night time's going to be here soon. Okay, I'll need to... So when it gets dark, it's getting orange. Maybe I'm still good for a bit, but... Oh, so the generator just runs all the time. Oh my god, yeah, I need to... I need to make a point of turning this off in the morning, don't I? God damn it. Um, idiot. Um, let me, uh, I better f fill it up again, haven't I? Uh, how wasteful. Uh, Riven's Law. How are you doing there? Welcome in. Um, okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah, we're like on day two, and I'm like seriously confused. Uh, <laughs> I've, so do you know uh how how do you tell Riven like uh like when uh like when night time's coming is it just literally the quality of the light it's just like it's got the sunsets coming on because it's all orange right I can't really I'm not sure we learned something okay I think I need to just uh get inside for tonight I'm just gonna have to chill for a minute I know what would be useful, in fact. Um, because I don't, oh, there's nothing I can really do. Like Ryan was saying, that's your time to prepare. Unfortunately, I have nothing to prepare. Do you know what I mean? There's, there's nothing going on at the minute, um, basically. Um, you know, I've just got to maybe stash some stuff. I'll stash some stuff for a minute. Ah, no room in a container. Ah, so max in the stack is five. Got you, got you. Uh, now I wonder if wires do anything apart from being turned to lockpicks. Who can say? Um, I'll take the matches with us, maybe? I need a rope for. Okay. Not a lot of storage spaces there, either. Right, how are we doing on time? It's, it's okay, it's five. It's a little bit early. Um, yeah, I'm very well, Riven. Thanks for stopping in. Um, yeah, fill the trench with your mushrooms. Yeah, we did, did the first one and we got like a couple of perks for it. I don't really understand though. Um, yeah, I picked like, this thing. I picked a skill, and then I picked a bad skill as well with it, which seemingly I should, seems confusing. But yeah, it's definitely night time now, right? It's not. It's coming on. Okay, I'm going to uh, step out and take a three-minute break now and get coffee. Uh, that should t time in with the night time. Because it's not really... this. I guess as you progress in the game, night time will be... Uh, like Ryan was alluding to, you you know, you make it back to your base and you'll be like, okay, now I can do some crafting or like sort out my inventory or you know, do something. We're not at the point where we've got anything to do uh, currently. So it's like... You know, my, I'm gonna. It's a bit early, but I'll. Uh, yeah, it's it's a time red mage. I feel so. Bear with me, folks. I'll be about three minutes, and hopefully, it'll be a. Uh, it. Oh, did I? What happened there? Oh, what the? F what the? F Is that someone at the front door? Should I be? Not answering this. I feel like it should be a trick, wouldn't it? It'd be sus as all hell. I've got this, sh this shizzle wandering around our, out there. I don't trust it at all. There's definitely someone knocking on our door then. Things we need to actually craft up in here. Yeah, the inventory upgrade. I don't even know what that is. Board with nails. Oh, is that a crude weapon? I shouldn't need to make that. Well, it probably won't last long. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. Oh, this is... Oh shit, there's freaking ghosts and stuff flying around out there. Oh! Ghosts are getting in the house. Get. Uh... It's disturbing. Uh, Riven, yeah, it's, uh, it, it's, it is a thing, isn't it? Jeez. I'm trying to get to grips with, like, what is going on, not in terms of the narrative, but, like, just, like, the gameplay, what is, like, the best thing to do. So there was f definitely freaking ghosts just all over the place there, wasn't there? And it looked like one came in the house and gave us a little, a little whack. I want the freaking watch from Wolf. I assume the watch will tell you the time. There's too much going on. Anyway, <laughs> I don't want to just like leave it there ticking over because it might be morning before I get back and I'll get another knock on the door. Uh, or who knows what is going to happen. Um, we are still alive. I don't... I don't make any assumptions about anything. Um, I feel like we need to... The first thing... The most important thing we need to do is find an axe. Because with an axe we can get wood. With wood we can make boards. With boards we can repair the well. Upgrade the... Um, the uh, workbench. And uh, barricade some of the doors and stuff. The windows a bit better. Um... It seems like a good thing to do. And also, assuming you have a plenty of nails, you can make, like, crude nail board weapons. <sighs> it's intense. Anyway, I'm going to step out for three minutes, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> this, is qu this is wild. Wild, wild game. Thank you to our producers for uh, voting for it.
Right, sorry to keep you waiting there, folks. Let's uh let's get back to it. My god, this um it's wild. I don't know what to <laughs> I'm definitely enjoying it, Ryan. I just I think I'd feel a bit more comfortable when we get a bit more established. Like um I feel like one, I feel more fluid with the controls and two, I kind of we get like a bit of a foothold. I feel like we've not got a foothold yet. Um, right, yeah, so it's still, it's still night time, isn't it? The freaking ghosts. There's ghost things and the knocking. I bet we would have died. If I'd opened the front door there, we would have died, I'm sure of it. Well, I guess we just we just chill here till morning. Yeah, it's, it's nothing we can really, really do. Now it's got a lock pick. Um, unless I use the lock pick on the, could have used the lock pick on that door to the east in the burned house with the people on the other side. It'd be tempting to uh, use these two boards. To, oh, here we go. Day three. Um. Excuse me. Um, trader, you just just walked. It. The mushroom trader just walked in my house. A man roughly my size is standing before me. I can barely make out his disturbingly familiar features through the matte visor of his helmet. The massive helmet is covered with an old sack and seems to be an integral part of the of his unnatural pale body. Uh, I remember him. He's the one who rescued me from the doctor's house. Oh, right there, bro. Thank you. The man reaches out to me with his black hand. It's covered in charcoal. There's something written on his worn woolen glove. Interesting. We need to stick together, brother. He can't speak. He's just like, yeah, look at his stick of charcoal. Sorry, my, uh, my positioning of my um face. I think maybe I'm, I might... Might be better to have my face down in the bottom left. It's covering up the um I seem to be covering up stuff, don't I? Um over here. Let me move myself down over here. I might cover up a little bit of text there, but I can read I can read you the text, so that's not too much an issue. Yeah, look at him. The artwork's pretty damn good. There we go. We'll try that. Um Yeah, okay, thank you, buddy. Let's be friends. His lips are moving. But all sounds are drowned inside the helmet. He shrugs, then takes the huge sack off of his back and drops it to the ground, revealing its contents. Okay, so yeah, so he's a trader. Oh my god, he's got loads of stuff. Right, um, he's got gasoline, scrap metal, all sorts of stuff. watch. Three hundred. I want the watch, don't I? I think shovel blade, axe blade. Now, if the axe blade was anything like the previous axe we used in the pr prologue, axes aren't actually very good. Uh, flashlight, very expensive. Metal pipe. Boards. But only have, have a value of six. Um, battery, matchstick tape. Uh, weapon parts. Uh, shotgun shells. Oh, God, a shotgun. I think it doesn't last very long. All sorts of gun parts. Um, pills, uh, gas tank hitting the valve, release a high pressure gas, and result in an explosion. Oh my god! Um, and fabric 450, the piece of fine fabric that's what you need for the upgrades, isn't it? Your inventory and your uh, hot bar upgrades. Um, so you got a lot of stuff, bro. I feel like I needed boards the most but i don't really have anything to trade him um so i'll show him my items oh I've what happened to my little chicken never mind uh showing the photo of the road he wipes his left glove on his pants takes out the charcoal from his pocket and starts scribbling when he finishes he lifts his dirty hand all roads lead deeper into the woods indeed buddy and does he just hang out here is he gonna live here now with us which I'm happy for him to do. 
interesting. Um, we don't have any mushrooms at the minute. Okay, so I need to... Now it's not... Now the night is over. I need to freaking... Get outside and turn off the generator. Just leave it running all day like an idiot. Ugh. It'd be nice to leave it running all day. Yeah, it uses about half, doesn't it? Um... Won't worry about filling it up now. So I want to... I guess I want to... Get back out there and explore. Um... Okay, I'm gonna... First thing I want to do, I want to head to the underground... Uh... Oh. Invitation. We invite you to a celebration behind the cornfield in the southwestern edge of the dry meadow. Oh. Tell me that's not all sus as all bloody hell. Uh, <laughs> um, to the children of the corn. I don't really know if I want to go to their celebration. Um, southwest of the edge of the dry meadow. So the dry meadow is... Uh, So yeah, this is uh this whole section is the dry meadow. So I guess it's down here, just I don't see anything down there where the wolf was. I did say the um I'm sorry, uh journal? There we go. Uh southwestern edge okay so i guess it's just west of where the wolf man was pack of cigarettes um that's what my journal said what i've added to it um day one night so i need to get back to my hideout before nightfall uh wandering here at night is too risky the forex exhibit yeah i read read that day two the wolf well i'm obviously going um if i'm not delusional the man whom i met had the head of a wolf he told me he will help me get the key back i just need to get through to the other side of the forest i'm to meet him in the southern part of the silent forest okay i should be uh, i should explore the surroundings before venturing forth i do not wish to act too hastily um the shadows it was a rotten strange night shadowy silhouettes emerged from the corners of my hideout i thought my eyes were playing tricks on me in the dark I'm certain I've seen something. If they come back, I should keep close to the light. Yeah, there's freaking ghosts. Right, okay. No doubt. You get, seem to get a, f a full heal as well when you, um... When you, uh, rest. Overnight, it looked like. Unless you've got, you've got, like, a super slow tick regen, I don't know. Okay, yeah, so I searched all this. So, here we go. So, first thing in the morning... We don't have a weapon, so I don't know if this is even a slightly a good idea. We're going into the underground entrance. So I believe this is where he said the key was. We, where we need the key. But um, let me just poke my head in to see what we can see. Um, not very freaking much. Rubble. Uh, the tunnel walls were crushed by enormous roots. Dig. N need a shovel. Need half a shovel to dig through there. Okay. We don't have that. Okay, so let's have a look in this direction. Backpack search. Oh, baby. A battery. Yeah, d uh, a light bulb dimly lit lits the wet walls, lights, I guess, of the uh, underground passage. Oh, sorry, the further part of. I don't know, I missed that. Anyway, a uh, motorcycle magazine. 
Thank you indeed. Twigsy? What's going on up in here, Twigsy? Twigsy? How you doing, bro? What's all that? Five gift subs? What's that for, Twigsy? You need to do that. Should we... Uh, even more astounded by the fact that this motorcycle magazine is actually a motor car magazine. But never mind that. Uh, so I don't know what we're doing with that. I'll take these boards and a battery. Uh, Twigsy, bro. Thuggish G-Ray, 1001. Um, uh, Abby, Lawsy, and Legion Cage. My God. Thank you, Twigsy. What's going on, sir? Are you well? Are you looking after yourself? How have you been? Last time we spoke, Twigsy, you were like, had some bigger decisions to be thinking about in your life. Feel free to uh, give us an update on those if you want. Thick wooden posts barely hold the soaked ground and the tangled roots. The construction seems on the verge of collapse. Oh my god. Wish I had a torch. Corpse with nothing. Oh, okay. I'm coming up on something here. Oh, I guess I made it through the underground tunnel. To who knows where. I haven't found locked, the locked door yet. This is armored door. Examine. There we go. The underground passage. Uh, locked. It's my only way out. I won't be able to open it without my key. Right, yeah. Look at the handle. Pressure against the keyhole. Look through the keyhole. Okay, look at the handle. The handle is covered in a thick layer of dust. It must it hasn't been opened for at least two weeks. Okay, let's listen to the door. There are a faint voice through the howling wind. It sounds familiar. It seems to be coming through the keyhole. Someone is calling me. Okay, look through the keyhole. Uh oh. Uh yeah, well, thousand and one. How you doing? Yeah, Twigsy's just chucked out some uh gift subs there. And uh, you picked up one of them, sir. So. Uh Right, you see a faint light in the distance. That's nothing, is it? Um, uh, I don't know. It seems very interesting so far. Um, wrecked. Uh, doesn't, I don't think so. Uh, I don't... There seems to be no... Unless it's auto saves. I don't really know. Um, um, yeah. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, I don't... I say, I don't... It, we've only just started, but... It seems fun so far. I don't know. Is, is a, I suppose it's a bit of an awkward game. Oh my god. I just poison myself. Right, okay. At least we found out what's going on here. Oh. Oh. Oh, we might be effed in the A right now. Uh. <laughs> uh. Yeah, part of the passage is blocked with overgrown tangled roots. Oh. Oh, no. The roots have grown back the way we came. Uh, oh, dear. Okay, no, no. This is, this is the way we walked through, I think. Yeah, okay. Oh, my God. Uh, Twixy, thank you for the lurk. Um, yeah, and thank those gift subs, bro. You don't... Not, never necessary, but I do appreciate it, Twixy. Examine... Who knows what? Oh, odd meat. Uh, is that human flesh we've just picked up there? Or, or the flesh of something? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What is that thing behind us there? Let's, let's, uh... Let's get a walk around over here. <laughs> uh, um, God damn it. Um, uh, Dirk Acacia, uh, Dirk Acacia, 
I don't. I've probably got you butchered your name there. Dirk, how you doing, Dirk? Uh, or Dur Dur Casaria? Even way. Dur Dirk, how you doing, there, friend? Uh, what is up? We we are playing Darkwood, and I don't know what's going on. I don't. <laughs> I, don't I don't know how we're doing. We're just we're, do we're doing. We're, we're we're slowly trying to work out what's going on. Anyway, so we learned something. We've learned something at least. We learned that's where the secret passage is, and yes, we do need our key to get there. Look, day three underground passage. Uh, the armored door in the underground passage is closed. It hasn't been opened in around two weeks. The thief who took my key apparently does not know how to find the passage. Good. I, on the other hand, have no idea where to find the thief. Not so good, indeed. Um. So, uh, maybe we should head over to the uh where the children of the corner are supposed to be. It should just be not far away. So we got that invitation. It seems sus as all bloody hell, but I feel like we should investigate all leads we come across. You know what I'm saying? Um, we have we just got to day three. Uh, Dirk. Uh, yeah, that's our that's our map there. We just we've been just been around this area here. I uh, I don't know what's supposed to be. We don't have any weapons or supplies or anything. I keep looking around for stuff. But yeah, so I assume we're like right here right now, and I don't, I don't see the children in the corner anywhere. So um, unless they're, I don't know. Oh no! F oh my God. So our overall main mission, I guess, is to head south and get to the Wolfman down here. He said, "Don't." It, it did it, it, the game kind of did hint to us don't go unless you're fully prepared but quite honestly I, you know i've looked around this whole area i'm pretty sure and we found practically next to nothing so unless the the burned house we can use a lock pick to get through that metal door which we might be able to i don't know unless we need a key um Yeah, I don't think I have too many boards though at the minute, uh, Dirk. That's the that's the issue. And if there's anything like the uh, the prologue, those weapons like last about three hits and then they're they're wrecked. Um, yeah, uh, it's with the main weapon of half of the game. <laughs> uh, so I'd be inclined to uh, make a couple of them if I had some more boards, but fortunately we don't really. Um, so I don't, I don't know uh, how best to go about it. I better check for my, the sake of my curiosity. Um, I better head back over to the east. Oh. The shrine. Okay. Uh, hello. Um... Who dat? Do I even know who dat is? <laughs> what the fuck? Um. Ooh. Ah, locked. If I had a lockpick. We do have a lockpick. Uh, so let's uh, pull my lockpick out. Yeah, I'm... Am I not opening a lockpick? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I need to do it like that. Okay, cool. Oh, right. There we go. It's got a battery. Some more gasoline, scrap metal, and some pills. Okay. That's cool. But now I've used my lockpick, so... <laughs> um, what would be the best thing to do now? Um, uh, if, if I want to go and drop some of this junk off, or... Uh... Oh, you bastard. Well, bugger. Uh, hello. Okay, we're not friends, are we? Where's this, this guy? Where's he going? This game is very mysterious. Is he even going anywhere? He's wandering randomly. Is... is... I don't know if, is he, if he's just walk, walking randomly or trying to get away from us.
I don't know. He doesn't seem to like us, though. Doesn't seem to be the case. Um, he's just running away. Yeah, that's what I thought, though. Maybe C Star. Maybe. Um. Right. Let me think. Um. So as far as I can tell, the only thing for us to do now is to try and head south down this way. Um. The question is, am I prepared to do that? Uh, I don't think... I don't know what else I'm, I can possibly do, actually, in all honesty. Let's just head over down that way. Now... Oh, have I made it? Oh, is this uh, back where... Sorry, wrong button. Okay, yeah. Um. Okay, let's quickly head over there. Let's see if we can get back before night time. Maybe we can't. We can get a lay of the land at least, maybe. I don't know. I can't believe that freaking moose or that elk or whatever was like. Just started to smash us. Just minding our own business. Uh, yeah, that my, my god, right there. Uh, I guess. <laughs> I guess the animals are just. Like, the darkness of the forest has like overcome them. And they're just like to attack on sight, I guess. Maybe. this way that uh, seems to be dead end okay not quite there yet oh we've got some freaking dogs yeah maybe if i uh maybe if i use the board the nail board to like kill some enemies um i can maybe like harvest their flesh and maybe sell it to the wolf man i don't know where even are we on okay we're up here I'm even trying to go this way. That's your way to go. God, this the stamina is uh, a thing. Oh, here we go. Entrance to the silent woods. Oh my god! What the, what was that? Oh my god. Oh, okay, we found a random building. Could prove useful. Oh no. A bug. Little but also little bugs. I mean, is it aggressive? No, they're not aggressive. Okay. Oh, we got f ghost activity here. Oh my god, what is going on there? A hole. No, thank you. This game, uh, chased, uh, or ch uh, chase. How you doing? Welcome in. Uh, yeah, we're just enjoying a bit of Darkwood. I have no idea what's going on. Um, yeah, it's it seems decent. It seems decent. I'm enjoying it. Uh, uh. Sorry, you've made content for YouTube, but you're asking me if it will scare you. I, I mean. You should already know the answer to that, right? <laughs> oh. Okay. Nothing in the oven. Oh, 
it's starting to kind of get a bit full on random crap. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, standing on random corpses hurts you a lot, apparently. I better pop this bandage, I think. Uh... Um, yeah, I don't know. Need the key. Okay. Wait for not so we're roughly around this place here. I'm not going to just rush through there. I don't know if you're even supposed to do that. Okay. Let me, um, head back out for a minute. Thank you. Uh, Ryan, what are you doing, buddy? Short and sweet. Uh, Queen Velvet, Akuma, Slider Games, Slick Mick. Ryan, bless your heart. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You and Twigsy today. I appreciate that greatly. Thank you. Thank you to both of you. Not necessary. Okay, and we've got a, a code on that door. Right. Now, is this essentially the entrance to the woods? As in, I have to either unlock this door or run through that pile of corpses there is that the uh the gist it seems like it doesn't it it seems like i can't actually just walk around that house <laughs> that's what it seems like um and another one ryan my god um no no chase i didn't i was i was gifted this by one of our producers recently uh it's ra absolutely seemingly random coincidence. Apparently, it's free on Epic Games today. I didn't know that. We're just playing the game. <laughs> a couple of other people have stopped in and been like, oh, Epic Games. No, no, that's a complete coincidence. Um, so, no, no, I just I just have, have got gifted the game the other day. Oh, there we go. That's coffee done. Um, so, yeah, I don't... Uh, I don't know. Let me, uh... I really wish you could know exactly where you were on the map. But I understand why it doesn't function like that. Right, okay. That is definitely the entrance. So as far as I could tell, we need to run across those corpses. Or somehow unlock that door. Let me just... I just want to double check. I just want to make sure. Let me, yeah, check around this direction. Or maybe not. We can get around this way. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we do. Okay. Um, I mean, I might be able to just survive just by running across, but it just seems to whatever is killed those, whatever those happens to those bodies there, seems to be doing a lot of damage just walking across them. Um. Yeah, yeah, I didn't even know about it. Didn't even know about it, Chase. Um, you're okay at best. You're okay at worst, Ryan. Ryan, pretending he's not a bad man. Um, yeah, thank th thank you, Ryan. It's all right. I feel, I, you have a little confidence if you want, Ryan. You've, I feel like you've earned it. Um... So, sorry, I keep pressing the wrong button there. Um, so, I clearly have to get head south there. But I feel like if I just run across that, I'm just going to die, aren't I? Now, we do have... Um, there we go, so I'm still getting used to controls here, folks. A bunch of stuff. So, maybe it's time to start, like, trading some of this stuff to the Wolfman. And maybe a couple of nail boards as well. Um, oh, my God. Oh. Bro. Jog on. Wow. I don't, I don't like him. I think we should kill him at some point. And if 
I'm going to get up in his good and slap him with a nail board, but... Yeah, it's our weird little shrine here. Yeah, give, tell me, let me take the crucifix or something, John. <laughs> the power of Christ compels you. Somehow, I... Don't feel that that would, like... <laughs> be uh of much use in this current situation um okay and that's back to the entrance with the uh where the uh the hole was um oh sorry let me just check what i've got that i could i feel like i need most of this stuff what, is it, is it, what does a nine volt battery do i don't know that's the thing isn't it um now let's get Let's go see the Wolfman and do a little test with the trading. Because there's no money, right? So you have to make sure that whatever you're giving him balances with what you want to get from him. It's like a literal direct trade. Let me see again exactly what he's got. It could be useful. Um, I know a little bit more to the east, isn't it? This is the where, this is where the uh, the invitation to the uh, the celebration is supposed to be, but I don't know whether you've got to go there at night time. It's not seem like a god there. Here we go. All right, there, bro. Keep you keep you also available for me there. Um, yeah, Chase. You'd think it would be, but who knows? I don't know. Um. Yeah, wrecked. I don't think you can. I think you just... I think it just must be auto-saved. Um, ah, yeah, show me the invitation. Excellent meat. An invitation to a wedding party. Oh, it's to the wedding place, maybe. Uh, the wolf snorts with laughter. His putrid saliva landing on your face. My face. Uh, it's an invitation to that house in the southwestern edge of the dry meadow. The music there has been playing non-stop since I remember, day and night. A never-ending wedding. He, he. <laughs> the wolf throws the invitation back at me. It's wet with spit. Have fun, meat. Just remember to hide that disaster of a face, or it's no dancing for you. Oh, okay. Curious. Um, trade, right. So we want his toolbox, and potentially I want that watch as well. Anything else, I don't know, if it would be of some use, I guess. So, let me, uh... Put the batteries over there. Oh, it, build, it builds reputation, does it? Okay. So, can you still do, do the transfer if it's in the minus? I don't know. Ah, let's give him the meat. I don't want this shit meat. Okay, he doesn't. Ah, so some stuff he doesn't take. Right, so he'll take pills. It'll take matches. But he doesn't want the most of the other stuff. God damn it. Oh, so reputation's your currency. Ah, so if I just give him those batteries. Deal. He's got those batteries. And now... We've got 100 reputation, so if we... Yeah, okay. But he doesn't want most things. That's a problem. He'll take matches. Which I guess we probably need. Um, And I'll take the pill. I wonder if we go cook that meat. He might, he might want it. Maybe we can cook the meat. Okay. I want to just try and head back to our house, I think. Where's this bro again? Just random, bro. <laughs> um. Yeah, this game is uh, it's original. I'll tell you this. I've not. I've played games with like a kind of a top-down view like this. They're usually like kind of like twin stick shooters or something do you know what i mean something like that nothing uh quite like this and nothing is like you know i've played like um 
crafting gathering survival games but like nothing that's quite like this um okay so i could repair the well there's gonna be some advantage to that isn't there surely let me see if i can cook the meat first ah uh, we can Oh, 12 essence, so it's just to get essence. So maybe that's the, what the cooking is for. That's all it does. And I did a mushroom, okay. Right, okay, what we... He doesn't want gasoline. Maybe he would want a flare. Maybe he'd, he'd take a flare from us. Um... Who knows what else he would be willing to take. He didn't want scrap metal, did he? He didn't want rags either. He might go for alcohol. He might go for an empty bottle. Um, He might go for rope. I don't know. I just want to try and give him anything we can to... Uh, let's see what's what. Okay. It looks like night time's starting to come on. I want to build the well. Why not drink? Oh, the well is dry at the moment. I'll check back tomorrow. Okay, you get a look at a heal. Seemingly. Right, okay. Um, right, let's fill this up. Um, no, there we go. Oh god, got a dog going here, boy. Uh. Guess I better turn it on, I don't know. Oi, oi, oi. Wild game. Um. Shame you can't smash up that stool for wood or something. I don't know. I'm going to disarm that because I don't see why I'd need a bear trap just sat there. I feel like it's really doing too much for us. Um. I guess maybe I should make a, a nail board. Um, let me just remind myself what I need for the upgrades. What's that there? A chain trap, yeah. Um, yeah, I definitely need uh, yeah. that cloth he's selling. The inventory and hot bar upgrades. Yeah. Um, upgrade an item. I don't know. Um... Let's make a nail board, so at least I have a weapon for emergencies. I wonder how long it'll last. It probably won't last that long, unfortunately. Um, we better just hang out in here for a bit. I'll, I'll, I will give him... I'll tell him our pills, I guess. Um, so I probably want to... Stash our uh, scrap metal. I don't know what that's for. Um, I'll uh, I'll take the wires. I don't know what the wires are for, apart from uh, uh, apart from turning to lock picks. So if you know, it might not be a terrible idea. Oh dear. Time to head out. Uh, oh my god. This game. It's uh, definitely an experience.
Um, oh, there's a freaking bro just stood here. Oh, let's get away from here. Who? Buddy, who, who, who? This isn't the trader, is it? The f what the hell? Um, oh, he's gone. He just vanished. He's a ghost. Oh my god, what is going on? <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. That's, that's, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Just move my... Oh, what's that out there? Mushrooms growing on the floor. Oh, yeah, so obviously you want to stay in the light, don't you? So if you reposition your lamps a little bit. Potentially opens up more uh, spaces to walk around your house at night time. Oh! How'd you get in here? Freaking hell. Yeah, look at our nail board. We've got like about another 10 10 uses of it and then it's <laughs> then it's gone <laughs> what how did the freaking dog get in here did i not shut the door properly or maybe i didn't oh my god they just wandered in from outside oh no we've got some more oh my god oh they it's uh busted down my oh my god Jeez Louise. Yeah, they've just knocked down my uh barricade there. Right, well I say barricade, it's not much of a barricade, is it? This is truly horrifying. Make some traps. Yeah, yeah. No doubt. I feel like I don't really have the uh the supplies at the minute, Ryan. I think it's almost morning though. Day four. Oh, okay. After each night survives, you gain reputation with the trader. All right, buddy. Okay, so he appears here each morning, does he? Oh, okay, so because he's got reputation with him already, he's he's gonna like to sell us stuff for free, I guess. He's gonna give us stuff. Now, the thing I actually want from him, I guess, the axe blade, maybe. I guess we need like wood to make the handle for it. Aye, aye, aye. Um. But we can probably sell anything to him, right? Maybe. Okay, before we do that, I want to... Oh, we can't cook that meat. Okay. Right. Um... I might want to sell him some other random junk that I couldn't necessarily sell to the wolf guy. Scrap metal. Running with gasoline. I don't know. Do I need all that cloth as well? The rags? I don't know. 
Okay, well, actually, first things first. He's not going to disappear when I walk outside, is he? He stays there for a bit. Yeah, okay. I just want to turn the bloody generator off so it's not just ticking away needlessly. There we go. Kuma, how you doing, bro? Are you alright? What's going on, sir? So, I have nothing to say to you. No, that's fine, buddy. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for it. Now, I probably need some of these to, for, for traps, don't I? But. So let's not worry about it. There we go. Ah, it's got wooden boards, which is what I need. And there are only six. Okay. Cool. Okay, I want this watch. Please tell me this watch actually tells me the time. Ah, it does. Yeah, check that. You see in the top, uh, top right there. Okay, cool, cool. We're getting somewhere slowly, folks. We're slowly making progress. We uh, we know what time of day it is now. Now I am going to, I'm going to assume, obviously eight a.m. is like morning time, I guess, unless it's started at seven or something. I don't know. Either way, we're good to go now. Let me just do a little test. Um. Okay, just having the watch in our inventory is enough. We don't even need to put it on the hot bar. Okay, cool, cool. Um, you just had your dinner. Excellent. Um, excellent, buddy. Please hear it. Uh, okay. So, uh, what else do we need to do? Um, I'll probably... Let's make a... Um, I mean, probably going to need a lockpick, aren't we? Let's make a lockpick. Um... Now, I want to get some wooden boards off him, don't I? Probably. That seems like a, a, not a terrible idea. Um, but I don't know if I possibly can at the moment. So we'll just do, give him that junk to just get a bit of reputation with him. Um... So yeah, aside from all these like random bullets and possibly gun parts, which no doubt would be very useful. We need the fabric as well. That can wait. Um, and he's got gasoline if you desperately need it. Uh, I I'm going to head to the Wolfman and give him see if he will take any of this other random junk we've got. Um, ah, okay, so time stands still in the morning. So I bet the trader's gone now. So I wonder if it's a 12 hour day or is it a longer day? It can't be less than 12 hours. I'm, I'm sure of that. That would be uh, pretty ridiculous. Here we go. How you doing, bro? Uh, right, okay. Cool, cool. So, yes. Yeah, so, um... Let's give him the flare. And the alcohol. And the pill. So, he's got no interest in an empty bottle or rope. Very well. Fair enough. Uh... And there we go. And that gives him 200 reputation. So let's get this toolbox. We don't know what's in it, but 
I mean, I would be inclined to get that anyway, even if Ryan had not said, you know, get a toolbox. Um, a deal. We got the deal, buddy. Now, what is in this toolbox? Um, uh, <laughs> yeah, the ability to read as well. I know it's wild, isn't it? Uh, Now, I assume he can't do anything with it. Maybe it's for something to later. Or maybe it's like an, a crafting material. You need the toolbox to make something else later. Um, so let me have to think for a minute. What's our next move? Um... The only place to go that I'm, I'm aware of it's to try and chonk through those that those pile of dead bodies down to the south to get into the, the silent forest. Um, I can't think of what else we need to do at the minute. Um, honestly, um, I don't have any heals or anything. We sold all the stuff we need for <laughs> just to get ourselves a watch, which it definitely feels important to me. Um, let's try. Although the wolf man said, "Oh, you better cover your face up." Let's try just going to the church for the wedding. See what we can see there. Because uh, at the minute, I don't know really what else we could or should be doing. I, need to, I think I need to do need to prepare a little bit better to try and head. I think I need to like some before we head south. Try and go through the, into the silent forest. There, I think we need um maybe a, a stock of nail boards and maybe so you know make sure we have some you know a stock of bandages. Um, it's um. It's kind of it's, not, I guess I say realistic. And that's that's appropriate. Uh, it's kind of tough in a way in the fact that I kind of part of me would think that there'd be like stuff lying around everywhere, but there's really not. You can like walk for quite a while, and then there's like not really much of anything hanging around. Oh, I've oh, got flat. We've got flowers now. I guess that's leading us to. The wedding, which I guess is down here, right? Okay. There's a bit of a, a path of them going through here. That's just, unless that's just showing you a way through. How weird. This doesn't really matter which way you go. Now, there should be like a doggo still down here, so. On this chain, so I probably want to. S slap him. If I uh, line up my attacks correctly. Awful creature. I don't want really killing dogs, you know what I'm saying? Oh. What are you supposed to do? Okay. Nothing around that sword. Okay. Hello? I'm here for the, uh, the celebration. I don't know if he's dragging a chair around. Oh my god. Uh, she's pretty intense, honestly. <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting. This is not. This is not exactly it. I say it's not. It's really not exactly like anything else I've ever played. Oh. Hello. Are you a friend? No. Are you a ghost.
Um. Can't just attack a random lady, can I? That's should I should I just be going out murdering everyone? Is that <laughs> is that what we should be doing here? Oh, we can drag this table, can we? That's interesting. I don't think we could drag any of the, the other tables. No. That table's different. I don't really see what that's doing for anyone. Okay. Random dancing lady. I guess she's the bride based on how she's dressed. I would imagine. Okay, let's head in here. And that's got the... A combination lock. I've got no clues. I really don't know, folks. Aside from... Just attacking her. That doesn't seem like the right thing to do. Let's see what the, um... Let me read the, uh... The uh, little invitation thing again. Not the, uh, not the plastic sheet. There we go. Behind the cornfield in the southwest edge. Yeah, it just. Oh wait, is that a little number there? Two one zero two. It was, okay. Alright, no, no power here. Ooh. Alright, some pills, some alcohol, a battery and a bullet. Okay, we've got a bit of music as well, apparently. That, oh my god, I can't carry most of this now. Uh, got some actual, some ammo. I should not be, not to do with all of this. Okay, well, never mind. Um, no room in the inventory. My god, okay, we'll have to come back here in a second, aren't we? Um, beg pardon? Oh, it's a pig. It's an actual pig, okay. <laughs> Okay, so I guess this functions as another safe house. Okay, that seems to be jammed. Okay, we've got items to pick up here. I don't want to... Let's jam what I can do about that. Is Okay, she's still just chilling, having a little dance out there. Oh, God. oh this is wild. She's celebrating that we're still alive. That's always handy. <laughs> That's a friend for you there. Oh, hi. You're alive. I'm, I'm pleased. I'm going to have a little dance. It's my wedding. Um... On, oh my god, what the freaking hell is that? Oh, it's just foliage, is it? Yeah. Okay, so I've still got um a flare and some pills to pick up. And a flashlight to pick up as well. Sure. Yeah, I got everything else. Okay. I'll have to, maybe I have to come back for those. Yeah, I don't know how you 
What? How do you dismantle these barricades? I'm not trying to barricade it. I'd like oh tractor examine. Rusty tractor growing branches of thin roots. Ah, a steering wheel. No room in inventory. Uh, gasoline. Yeah, okay. I'll have to come back here for this stuff here, folks. That music is creepy as all bloody hell. Um. Right. Okay. Um. I'll turn it off for a little bit. The music's going. It's like banging is still going. I don't want to murder a pig, necessarily. Um. Right, okay, I'm going to... What time is it? Two in the afternoon. I'm going to try... Get back to our house. Drop off all this stuff we've found. And, uh, come back, see if we've got time to come back and get the other stuff. Um, oh yeah, can we just head in this direction? You want the, you murder the pig, you want bacon? I mean, maybe we, maybe it's, that's a good thing to do, actually, Scotty, to, you know, but I don't know. Maybe we should just go, like, murdery murder on everything. So we've had wildlife attack us, and that's, you know, fair enough, we'll, uh, we'll defend ourselves, but if we... If we've got friendly wildlife. Okay, so the well is literally uh having a little drink. Um Damn, okay, let's uh store this ammo, I guess. Uh the toolbox, I don't know what it's for. It's not required for a crafting material thing, is it? Um Yeah, six boards, and we can upgrade this. So maybe it's uh, to do something else in a minute. Inventory upgrade. Yeah, the cloth. Uh, hot bar upgrade. I would, f I would feel that it's nice to have more hot bar, but inventory upgrade is probably more important, I would feel. So let me uh just stash that for now, I guess. Um I'm gonna sell a bunch of this stuff, I, I imagine. Uh Okay, it's four o'clock. I'm gonna risk it. Night time. Surely eight o'clock would be the earliest. You'd, you'd think. Okay, it's not. It's not far to go, is it? Yep, she's still going strong. Curious. Yeah. Can't, uh, can't bash down the metal door, I would assume.
Is that uh, too presumptuous? I don't know. Definitely, uh, no way through here. Unless I've, uh, just got to smash the window down? No. Doesn't seem to be a thing. Yeah, okay, I might be able to smash the barricade down, but I can't. Oh! Jump through the window. Just climb climb through the window. There we go. <laughs> That's what we were trying to do. Okay. Let's see what the blood hell is going on here. Maybe um, maybe it's safer to uh, have the generator on while I'm trying to deal with this situation. Oh god, it's night time's coming on, isn't it? Oh my god. We've been waiting for you. Who's saying that? Oh, this guy. Oh, he, oh, that's what the... He's smashing his head against the table. That's what it was. Um, buddy, you don't have to do that. You could, like, totally not do that if you wanted. You know what I'm saying, bro? Oh, oh no, it's not. Oh, want to dance. No, I do not want to dance. Oh, oh, we've got ghosts all up in there now. Oh, there we go. That's why it's blocked, I assume. Will you dance with me? No, I don't want to dance with you. Oh, no, the lock is actually just completely jammed. Okay. Okay, so night time seemingly is like 6 o'clock in the evening. Oh, my God. This game is pretty freaking intense, folks. It got light, though. I don't know if it's going to... I think it's going to last the duration here. Homie, what are you doing to yourself? Oh. I don't like the fact that we're stuck here like this, but... Yeah, we don't really want to be out there at the minute, do we? We just have to just chill here for a bit. And hope that the uh, the generator lasts throughout the night. So if not, I'm gonna be like effed in the A, aren't I? Let me um, me uh, hold by that torch there. Uh, I'll press the right fucking buttons up now. Uh, I don't, I don't know. How you tell me F, and you can answer that. Uh. And also maybe the flare, just in case I need to use it desperately. Maybe I need to drag the sofa in front of the door. Oh, oh, what? What? What's that? What is... What? What? Is, what's... what's uh, ah, nah, nah, nah. What's all this about? Yeah, that's doing... That's the way that is. That's doing damage to us. Uh, flashlight. Is that going to help? 
That's not helping at all. Let's try the uh, flare. Oh, we got deaded, folks. We died. Right, okay, yeah. So I guess it's not just the light you need. It's, uh... Are we on the next day? Is it, is it the same day reset? We the start of the same day? We lost all our items? We haven't lost our items. Uh... We lost a bunch of our items. Intra I'm, I'm slightly confused. Uh, okay, so... We lost some items, maybe. I don't know. Uh, well, it's the steering wheel seems to be for something in particular. He doesn't want that. Uh, I need some nail boards, don't I? Good on nails, right? Okay, my god. Um, okay, we need to be at our uh... right. So, I don't know what the because we're playing on normal, I don't really know what the consequence that we just died there like how how bad of an issue that is. Maybe we should just upgrade the workshop and see what new stuff we can make. A lantern, a bit of gasoline, some rags, and a bottle. Cool. Uh, Molotov cocktails. A uh, single shot pistol. Okay. I need the toolbox and more wood. Okay. Cool. Cool. Um. Yeah, I'm just, um... Okay, I don't want to be in the negative with him. That would, that would not do us any good. I'm doing on time. Alright, it's so, like 20 past 6 at the minute. There we go. Right, okay. That allows us to make a shovel. Uh, which need a stick and tape and the shovel head, I guess. Uh, homemade shotgun. Oh, hell. Useless after firing a shot. So a single shot shotgun. Yeah, I don't know how useful that's going to be. Pistol. I don't know what those materials are there. Gun parts, I guess. Um, and tape. <laughs> um... Right, there's another toolbox somewhere out there. Okay, um... I feel like we're making some some degree of progress, even if it's not the greatest degree of progress. Um... Give me some more nails, don't I? Uh, uh, two. Uh, I just sell the selling the freaking flashlight. Honestly, Yeah, there we go. That's, that's the uh, the weapon parts, four fifty, uh, and the uh, handgun frame, four fifty. So to make a handgun, no, no, no bullets, but just to make a handgun, that's going to be nine hundred <laughs> reputation we need with him. Hmm. Uh, never mind. Okay, one, one thing at a time. Okay, well, so we'll accept that. There we go, make a couple of nail boards. 
could have something in the way of weaponry. Right, okay. I stole that steering wheel. I don't know what that's for. No, I can just cook at a minute, I don't think. No, no. Um, I'm selling the meat. Let's store the board in there. And the battery. The battery is going to be for something, but I feel at the minute we don't. It doesn't really matter too much. Um, we're just better off getting that reputation. Uh, I think it's got too much else we kind of need at the minute. Right, okay. Uh, well, we died the first time, but it seems to be on normal difficulty, at least not too much in the way of uh, consequence. So let's get back, back to it. We, well, we we lost a bunch of items. So I guess if you just kept dying over and over again, you would kind of be effed in the A, but... Unless those items... Unless it's like Minecraft or Terraria, where those, like... Your items are just kind of, like, still there. Well, let's have a look. Let's actually explore out on the other side of that building. Now, is that lady still there doing a little dance? She is. Just chilling. Right, okay. I mean, if she's enjoying herself, better than the dude in here slamming his head on the freaking... on the table. Bro, you want to turn that music off? Um. Okay, the music's still going even though I've turned the radio off. That's rather disturbing. Okay, we're just trying to look outside, I think. Oh, it's very spooky around here. Oh, hello. She's out here as well. Or is it... This is a different bride. How many how many brides do we have? Um, so where did I die? I don't know. Let me get to the spot I died. It was up in this room, wasn't it? Ah, backpack. I think that's the stuff I'd lost, was it? We've been waiting. Oh, my God. For you. Well, screw you, matey. Dance with me. No thanks. Um. My God. Get, got yeeted again. Okay, that was the bride, wasn't it? She's actually a monster. Okay, that's death number two. Okay. My God. Can't fight that thing. So, I don't know if I should... I've got every... Oh, I've, I've lost all my gear again, haven't I? God damn it. Um, or some of it, at least. It's not losing my watch. Yeah, yeah, one of our nail boards has gone. God damn it. Okay, so I need to... I need to try and fight that thing. I don't know if... Uh, how well... One took me by unawares there. I'm just going to at least get in there and get my stuff. Okay, but we know those brides are not friendly. We know that.
God, it's freaking talking to us as well. Disturbing. Oh wow, it's dark as all bloody hell now. Piggy's still there, chilling. <laughs> um. Oh, I've got a key. None of my keys fit. Oh, I can't get back through here. Oh, that door. Oh, that door got wrecked, didn't it? I don't know if I lost all my stuff. I oh, know there. There we go. Okay. So, so you don't permanently lose any of your stuff. At least. Uh, it doesn't know I can actually get out there now, which uh, I guess is fine. It's so disturbing. <laughs> that's a that's a that's a nice emote you've got there, Sister. Not surprised. You usually do. I don't know, folks. I don't know if I can. Uh, Get back through there. And the window is barricaded. Yeah, I'm... Maybe there's something out there. But I feel like... I, I don't know. I can't seem to get back through there. Right. Okay. Um, what are my options? I guess it's trying just head south, isn't it? Now. Let's do our best, eh? Let's see what we can do. I don't feel it's late enough in the day to wait until the next day. Oh, that's a wolf, man. Joel, you all right there? How you doing, buddy? Hope you will. We shall. Um, how you doing? You at work, are you, bud? You you get on that. Don't let us stop you. You know, playing this wild ass game here, Joel. Darkwood. It's uh, it's freaky. And uh sort of disturbing as well and uh pretty tense. That way. I don't need to put my items out. I felt like it was here, wasn't it? Must be further along a little bit. Yeah, it's weird, Joel. Yeah, I'm sure you would. It's um so you don't really know what's going on, and the uh, the gameplay is a little bit awkward. It's, it's taking some getting used to. Okay, that's where I just tried, wasn't it? Back up here. But yeah, I hope you're doing well, Joel. I hope you're well, young sir. This way? Oh, 
Yeah, this looks vaguely familiar. Yeah, here we go. Okay, it's nothing in the generator. Uh, yeah, I've got to just run across these bodies here, haven't I? Let's go. Okay, cool. It just take you just took like half a bar of damage. That's all. And now we're. Oh, <laughs> you going this way? Oh, and again. Okay. Egg. Something is floating inside. The skin looks to be quite thin. Maybe it could puncture or pierce it with something. Should I even do that though? I mean. Okay. Uh, I need to switch to my other bat there. Oh, okay. Oh, embryo. Of what? <laughs> An embryo of what? It's worth 60 though, so I mean, I'll... I guess I'll take that. This game. <laughs> um, no, you drive... Well, don't... Freaking don't be driving unless you know what Tuba's doing. Oh, and we've got another code. Um... Are you doing t voice to text, Joel? I insist that you stop speaking right now, so I don't want you having an accident or anything. Um, I'm doing very well, bud. I'm doing very well indeed. Um, I don't know. Have we got any other... Have I picked up any other codes that I'm... Some kind of clues. 1987. Did we pick that up around here? Wrong code. I don't know. Okay, as long as... You, yeah, do, do be careful, Joel. I don't want any... I would uh, hate for anything bad to happen to you in general. Um, let alone be when you're talking on, you know, on the, on the channel. That would not be good. Um... And that's all from the uh, beginning there. Okay. I'm um, somewhat confused. I think we have to go through this door. Yeah, we've got a code. Yeah, I've not seen anything. There's a code. Maybe go back to the Wolfman and ask him if he has any idea. Or maybe he likes the embryo. He'll be like, ooh. Oh, I wouldn't mind going for a bit of that embryo you've got there, matey. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, okay, you can have this if you like. Oh, idiot. We just walked through the wall there. I swear to God, I'm a genius. Uh, <laughs> although, it's not necessarily going to take us anywhere, is it? Because, uh... We've got some rags there. Nice. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. God damn it. Uh. Okay, so there's a crazy guy in there we need to kill. I see. Oh, what time of day is it? I guess it's not. Is it night time right now? Oh, I've not lost my watch, have I? Oh, fuck's sake. I've lost my watch. God damn it. Okay, let's go back down there. I swear to God. Yeah, you can jog on, son. Oh, oh! Wooden logs, eh? Even, uh... 
Oh, well, just obviously I didn't come across to this, obviously. Um. Oh, okay. That's going to let... If I put those in the uh, sawmill. But I better take these... Get back... Take these... Uh, and the crate. I yeah, I'm not sure I've missed this. Yeah, yeah, okay. Just... I don't even know what time of freaking day is. <laughs> okay, I'll need to uh, get these back though, don't I? Oh, there. Okay, it's just uh, nearby this. Oh. Scum. Okay, I better head back and uh, do something with these. Oh, a shiny stone. I mean, I can't just leave that right. Uh, I'll do something with something. Um, making a bandage is not going to help. Um, it's random stones. Maybe I can uh, valued zero. Okay, maybe. Uh, I'll drop those stones. I don't think I need the stones, but... A shiny stone, though. It's got value. Oh, okay, and you can just leave stuff along the ground. Okay. Interesting. Um... Losing track of where we are. Oh my god, I've all made it all the way up here, have I? Okay, so we're gonna go uh gonna directly east, roughly speaking. God, say your stream has flown by. This uh this game is very absorbing. Right, okay, here we go. So we wanted to uh, put uh, these in here, right? So I, don't, I can't do anything with the logs, right? So they might as well go in there. Um, so how... I guess we... Ah, oh, we have to turn the generator on, don't we? So obviously the sawmill's not going to run without the generator. I should probably see how what it takes to repair these uh, planks. Okay, cool. So how do I make it go? Um, ah, there we go. Minus 25 fuel to do one. Okay. So we'll get some fuel in it. Okay, we can do that. Okay, so maybe I didn't need the generator switched on, but it is clearly almost night time, so... I think we've got some more gasoline in the house. There we go. God, look at all these planks that we've got. 
Okay. We strictly need them in, in a minute. Okay, let's um repair item. There we go. What do we need to repair? Needs more wood. Okay, so not as many nails, but you need, you need more planks to repair them. Okay, well, I guess I should probably take all those planks. Probably fix up the house a little bit. I mean, probably. Oh, jeez. There we go. Got a door. Um, barricade. I need to, um, fix that hole in the wall there, don't I? How do I do that? Can I do that? Is that even an option? Doesn't necessarily seem to be, does it? <laughs> God. <laughs> Someone in here making funny noises at us. Got no nails. No more nails. Oh. What? Some random weirdo He's just popping a flare. Oh, that flare's so helpful, though, right? That's someone trying to help us. He's like, here, yeah, I have a flare. Keep keep the keep the darkness at bay. I don't know. Random. I guess technically that helps. It seems a bit sus, but Yeah, I need nails. I can't do anything else about nails. Oh dear. You coming for me? I'm gonna whack you. Jeez. People stomping around out there. This game is pretty intense. Right, so next, once we've survived the night, I need to get back down to um the uh yeah, the entrance to the silent forest, that house. Get my stuff back, my freaking watch. And uh slap the try and slap the shizzle out of that random guy. So maybe I'll be a bit more prepared when I, uh, when I, uh, come across them again, maybe. So if the trader's here in the morning, I want to s maybe sell him some stuff and get some more nails, if he's got some more. Maybe, maybe he doesn't replenish his supplies, I don't know. Okay, someone's murdering a doggo out there. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! You want some, son? God damn, he's tough. Oh, he's about to eat us. 
Right, that's death number four in our own house. Oh my god. Uh... <laughs> God damn it. Oh, I don't even know if we're making progress at this rate. So yeah, there's no way to fix that hole in the wall. God damn it. Okay, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. <laughs> uh, okay, he does, he does replenish his nails. Thank God for that. Um, okay, we're all right on planks, I think. God oh, damn it. Um, <coughs> I don't know if it is it even worth it. I don't know. Um, it seems like that's the thing I should do, but... The thing is, if they can just push that out of the way... And there's nothing to, uh... I don't know. Um, I'll sell him the alcohol. I guess um, if it doesn't really matter that we keep dying, then I guess technically we're con constantly making progress. Does that make sense? Okay, I'm going to uh, try and repair our um, and get over yeah, one board and five nails. So it is, it is cheaper to. Something's already in good condition. No, it's not. Oh yeah, sorry, it is. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that one's not. There we go. Fully repaired. Excellent. Oh, okay, we can't, um, you can only sell him so much if he's got, like, a full in inventory. Yeah, so we need to buy stuff off of him before we can sell any more stuff to him. A watch. We want to get our actual watch back, don't we? We don't want to be buying another watch from you, buddy. Hmm... Right, right, well, let's just take the pills with us, I guess. Work for a quick heal. Right. Let me, um... Some of this gasoline in the, uh... In the sawmill. Okay, let me make sure the, the uh, generator is fully st stocked, and then I'll just bosh the rest of that in there. Aye, aye, aye. This game is, um... It's tough, but it's not actually... I mean, I guess it's not actually... It's not like really a massive... Uh, 
on normal, it doesn't seem to be that too much of a problem dying. You know what I'm saying? You just get kind of reset back where you were. Okay, that's that done. Okay. Right. Okay. I, I'm just going to take a 60 second break, guys. We've got two hours of the stream left. Um, next plan of action will be to get back down to that place again and uh, try and uh, collect our items back and see if we can kill that guy. He seemed pretty intense. I don't know. I like the guy busting our house seemed pretty intense. Like, a gun would be nice, but I think we have to build up to that, don't we? I'll be as quick as I can. Thank you for being here, folks. Uh, bear with. Right, back on it. Make sure I'm lined up there, probably. This game is a wild, wild game. Uh, right, okay, we are back off to the races. Let's go. Oh, can't wait till we get... A, imagine having a gun and having, like, it function well and having ammo for it. We'll see, maybe one day. <laughs> I need my watch back, I don't know. You can fuck off, mate. Oh, fucking your gun, son. Oh, my God. Seriously. I've got dogs as well now. Oh, we just died. I oh, just died again. Yeah, that's five so far. Okay, oh, I guess we've not lost anything because we didn't have anything to lose, sort of, I guess. Um, I don't think. Maybe I did. Uh, maybe some stuff got lost there. I think I should be... Uh, just Door in my uh, wooden planks. So I guess we don't really need those. Oh, okay, let's try again. Uh, I was trying to see if we got that. I saw that bear trap there. I was trying to see if he was going to go for that. Yeah. My 
God, yeah, Scotty, it's, uh... I just think that there's a difficulty on this where it's a permadeath. You just die and then game over, start from the beginning. I don't know what the, mid the middle setting was. It wasn't like permanent. I think he said you had an a a X number of lives. So you can die a few times, but... Oh, Stupid bastard. Right. Uh, but um, then, it's, then it's like game over. You have to start from the beginning. So I guess on this, on normal, it's like infinite lives, but still. Okay, there's our stuff. Thank God for that. Let's remember where you get back to it. Now, the question becomes, is it like... So those of you not familiar, Dark Souls is kind of like that with your XP. You get XP for killing enemies. And then you can't spend your XP to level up until you get back to a safe zone. Uh, if you die, you lose all your XP that you're currently carrying around with you. Before you've like cashed it in, so to speak. Uh, by lose, it means it like your items in this, it drops in the space you die. And now if you have to get back to that space, that spot, and pick pick up your XP again, basically. If you die a second time before you recollect your XP that's been dropped in the world, it's gone forever. You've lost it. Now I'm hoping that this game is not doesn't take that similar philosophy like the Souls games do. Because if my, you know, I'm hoping my watch is still down to the south there where I left it. If it's not, and it's just gone, then this could be an uphill battle getting through this game. <laughs> uh, don't know, you know, give it the benefit of the doubt, eh? We'll see. Because I spent a lot of money on that watch, or reputation, or, you know, whatever the case may be. We'll have to just hope for the best, I guess. Wait, is this, this the way it was? Yes. Yeah, okay, almost by there. Yeah, he's in that room there, aren't you? Aren't you, bro? Oh, I used all of my, uh... Used all of my uh, gasoline, didn't I? So I can't even light this place up. Which I don't even know if that would necessarily help. Right, okay, let's go. There we go. And we need a code for that. Okay, we established that. Now I bet I better uh, maybe pop up pills if we're going into a fight. Um. Okay, the pills don't seem to be healing us. Uh, <laughs> this is very, very slow heal. Oh, I think it's like it. Actually, I think it might be. Or maybe ah, maybe you have to metabolize them till they kick in, so to speak. Okay, that's where we got our weird egg embryo thing. I think maybe I should wait for these pills. To, unless the pill, the pills are like pain pills, like you're immune to damage for a minute. That would be weird, but maybe that is how it is. Right, it's almost run out or done its effect. Let's see what happens. Anything? No, nothing. So it didn't heal me at all. So going to assume pills is like a damage reduction, something like that. Now I've got to try and fight this motherfucker with my little stick, my little nail board. Hey, buddy. Wow, he hits f f so much more harder and faster than we do. I don't know how I can kill him with a nail board.
yeah i'm uh slightly confused as to what the best thing for us to do is yeah i mean it's even marked there unless that's that's the mark for us yeah lost inventory okay huh um I'll try, I'll try again, I guess. Uh, have we got any heals at all? Um, we haven't anymore, have we? Uh, I don't really have any supplies to make anything. Okay, let's, let me just give it another go, I guess. Uh... Okay, fallen tree. Maybe you might have to chop that up if you had an axe. Yeah, you dog guys want want some. Hey. Eh? That's the from that asshole. So yeah, there's like a wind up with your attack. Um and it seems like if you get a hit yourself while you're trying to heart mid swing, you get interrupted. Oh my god, there's another one. Jeez. Uh so I don't know. I don't really know. Well the best thing to do is I'm not trying to run right now, I'm just trying to take it slow. Okay, I'm, we're back here. This is some benefit to taking gasoline with us, but of course, uh, I uh, have have none at the minute. Okay, we've got another. Um, just to make sure it's not uh, related to the the magazine. Yeah, eight was it nineteen eighty seven? One code, okay. Not much point in repairing a door, even if I've had the materials. God damn it. Let's look and break down this door and just go through this way, maybe. Maybe not. Assuming not. God damn it! This we're half dead again. So and I don't even know if this is uh, going to benefit us because nowhere around that way. So as far as I can tell, we have to get through that door and find the code. I'm just kind of assuming that there would be something worthwhile in this room. Now I've just got to be more a bit more clever and it's like maybe a hit and run attack. Hit him and then run away to Like that. Oh, did I kill him? Dead savage staff. Would un of unknown origin. Okay, cool. Yeah, we go and that's our watch. Thank God and the our embryo. Okay, so we're go we're getting somewhere. Ah, Chaven, how you doing? Sort of keep you in there, buddy. Yeah, all is well. We're playing a crazy game called Darkwood, uh, which <laughs> is taking some getting to grips with. It's a survival horror top down. Uh, bird's eye view kind of game um but well, it's i ain't doing arch haven well um it's wild wild game it's very like dark and weird there's a lot of 
unexplainable weirdness going on. We're kind of like trapped in the woods, trying to escape. Um, but we've learned something there. If you die, your inventory gets left where you died, but it will stay there even if you die again, even if presumably even if you die multiple times. So nothing is truly lost. Um, which is good. Right, wardrobe. Ah, uh, here we go. Notes. Need yeah, that to be something. Bread, consumable. Okay, I guess that's going to be good, right? And pills. Okay, let's have a look at the note. Here we go. The door code is 3333. It can't get any easier. Remember it. I'm not opening that door after dark anymore. Yeah, no doubt. I want to get some gasoline from the pig shed. I'll be back after dark. Well, good luck with that. So I guess it's not this door, right? Presumably. It is, but is it also this door down here, which is the actual one we want it to be? It is. Excellent. Now, it won't be long till night's coming on. Oh, my God. We've got some shotgun shells. A map of the forest. Okay, let's have a look at the map then. Right, two locations. Silent forest hideout. Uh, Piotrek's house, and then Wolf's camp. Okay. Um, yeah, it's three o'clock in the afternoon. Let's just head directly south. Got something in there with us. Of course there is. There always is. Uh, and let's see if we can get to the, the hideout down here. Oh, jeez. Got savage. Okay. Okay. Here we go. This has got to be the house, right? Yes. Okay, so let's see if we can do something with this. Gasoline. Nice. Uh, fan belt. Okay, I don't know what that's for. That's a sawmill. The generator. Switch it on. Okay, cool. So, we can presumably hide out here. I just need to uh, fill this up, I think. So hopefully that means we can stay here to you know for the night. There we go. Okay. All right, some logs. All right, nails. Uh, wooden planks. Oh, I'm trying to smash the door down. All right, random crate. I need it locked. I need a key. Not a not a lock pick. A key. None of my keys fit. Okay. Box. Um. Potato and bread. Okay, we'll come back for that in a second. I presume this is the main house. I'm not liking uh, all these lack of doors and stuff. I can tell you that. Right, alcohol. Wooden door, wardrobe. More bread. Oh, lots of bread around here. Uh, pills and wire. Okay. So. There we go. So we've got the oven and the workbench. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll light the oven. Of course we'll light the oven. Jeez. Uh, you're familiar with the game, are you, Archaven? Excellent. Oh, my God. We are fumbling. Is You're not wrong, bud. You're not wrong. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Right. Oh, the embryo. 160 essence. Uh, now, do I... That's not gonna, we're not going to lose any, are we? No, no. Cool. Right, so we've... So what's going to be best? Uh, eagle eye we've already got, haven't we? We can't get that again. Um, once a day, I'm able to heal myself by standing next to an electric light source. I mean... Um, once a day, I'm able to learn my current location on the map. Uh, eating mushrooms by healing yourself. None of these are particularly amazing. 
Um, I guess take the the moth, the light. Get a free heal next to a light source, I guess. Oh my God, yeah, it's yeah, Arch It's a wild old game. Did you play it back like years ago when it was it came out? It, it's like it came. I think it came out like almost like eight, seven, eight years ago, originally. Uh, what? Sorry, where are we? We in we in Dreamland or something? And suddenly appeared who knows where with a, a flashlight in a, a tunnel. We've got a shiny stone. Okay. This is too many drugs. I don't know. Too many mushrooms. Shrooming it up. More shiny. We got a bunch of shiny stones. I freaking. I, I mean, I need them with a reputation. Um, armored door. Oh, wait, we're back down here. Door 21. I can hear a faint voice with the howling wind. Seems familiar. Someone's coming through the keyhole. Someone's calling me. Yeah, we did that before. Oh, okay. What? Is that somebody's ear? Or something. Come, come to me. Oh, okay. Come here. We're having a bit of a, a trip or something. We are for in, we are distilling and injecting freaking mushrooms into ourselves, so I can't say I'm surprised. I don't know where we're going. Oh, oh, let's not go that way. Let's stay away from that, yeah? Oh, he got us. Maybe. Kind of almost has got us. Right, okay. That was that's we get for doing too many drugs, kids. Uh, now, do we get to keep and the shiny stones? I assume not. We did not. Okay. I need another toolkit. Upgrade items. Yep, nothing to upgrade. Repair. Yes. Uh. There we go. Need no, more wooden boards. Okay. Anyway, I think I was trying to bosh some mushrooms as well in there. There we go. All right, there's no wooden wooden boards around, is there? That's kind of a problem. Um. Now, where's the light? Yeah, that's a problem, isn't it? Okay, we've got a bunch of rags. That's not really going to help too much. That's her shoes. Yeah, there's nothing in the shoes. <laughs> oh, a battery. In the doghouse. Or dead doggo. Build a well. Aha. Aha, we got we got wood. We need to stash some things for a, a minute. Um just random crap on the floor. Yes. We'll stash something yeah, stash some things in the tractor maybe. Ration stamps. What the hell? 
Um, okay, I'll stick those there for a second. All right, it's close to night time right about now. Okay, that seems like the extent of that. I guess we'll repair the well. Have a drink, I don't know if that's necessary. Um, you know, the sawmill. Um, oh, damn it. There we go. Oh, it's time to get the generator on, isn't it? Or we will be uh, in a bit of a situation. Oh! God damn it. Mushrooms just grown out of nowhere. Right, um. I need to, uh. Take this little light with us, I think. So we can't even repair that door there, so I want to take this somewhere we can actually close ourselves in a little room, maybe. <laughs> so I think it's back if I build a door back up where the kitchen is there. That should be right. I don't know why I carried it's a freaking lamp there. I should take that one. <laughs> I swear to God, uh, yeah, it's yeah, it's uh, yeah, it's not like a uh, retro, is it, Archhaven? But it's uh, it's a little bit, it's not like brand new. Oh, nope. nope. How weak is this guy? It's like <laughs> he's got to uh, mess around like this. Repair the doorway, yes, please. Barricade the window, yes, please. And can we do that door? No, let's just close the door. There we go. Right, we're chilling here for a minute, folks. Um, a bike bell. Someone's attached a note to it. I'm sure I don't want to be ringing this, but... If you want to fight me, bro... You, you can cut... You can bring it... Oh, yeah, God, he stepped into that room there. The door's open. Oh, my God. Why can you attack quicker than me? Why can you attack quicker than me? Fuck's sake. Sorry, language. <laughs> I don't want to be even ambushed. I don't understand. They like their they their attack speed is way better than ours. But again, we that's what number of death is that? Is that six now? Doesn't really matter. There's not no real consequence of dying. And I guess that's the that's the trick, isn't it? To uh Right, something is happening from ringing the bell. You, sh you sure about that? God damn it. I don't know. Sounds, the man stands before me motionless. Uh, I can only see his own faint reflection in the semi-transparent visor of his helmet. Suddenly he starts to move quicker as if looking for something in his pockets. He takes a piece of charcoal and starts right in his palm. There's no way out of here, brother. He shows me what he's written, then wipes it with his sleeve and continues scribbling. We're stuck with each other. Uh, after making sure I've also read the second sentence, and takes out a full tank of gasoline from his sack. He places it on the floor next to me. 
bless you. He's a good guy. Um, all right, are we selling him anything? Now, I think the staff was part of the crafting of the axe, wasn't it? Um, I'm pretty sure. Okay, that'll do for now. I guess we want to try and get the fabric for the upgrade, but... Here's what it is. Um... Well, I guess getting any mushrooms, you know, to... To cook is uh, definitely not a bad thing, so you're working on your, your upgrades, aren't you? Um... That was nice of him, though, just to uh, give that to us like that. Um... Right, so I guess we're... Well, we probably need to search this whole area. Honestly, to some... Just try to, to some degree. Um... Okay, let's... Turn the generator off, shall we? Oh, bike man. Hello. Hey there, boss. I'll be honest here, boss. I'm really thirsty, you see. If you could share a refreshing beverage with a weary traveller, I would make it worth your while, boss. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. When life's a bitch, booze is a must. <laughs> uh, I'll show them the f our photo of the road, uh, I guess. A beautiful road, Mr. Bossman. Long and straight. You'll find only twisted paths in these parts, mister. Uh, the man waves his hand sloppily, almost losing his balance. Uh, let me tell you something, mister. A good liquor straightens out all the paths, every single one of them. <coughs> so if I find some booze, I can give it to that bro there. <coughs> ah, of course. That's the... Uh the bike man, as in the uh, the the bell there. I wish it wasn't just stood there like that. Uh, Okay, I'm just going to cash in our reputation, I think. I'll just buy that fabric off him. Oh. Oh, is that a free heal? For the, 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 the free moth heal? Oh, what the... Oh, okay. Ah, of course. Yeah, nice. No, so that's to bring... You just press A to bring up your uh, a bit of skills there. Okay, cool, cool. Um, uh, yeah, not trying to upgrade does trying to upgrade the inventory. Yeah, help bar upgrade. Okay, I need, uh, I'll not just buy the cloth off him. I thought I did. Oh, I didn't accept it, idiot. There we go. Uh, right, so hot bar or inventory. I feel inventory is going to be better for the you know, to start with, just being able to carry more stuff. 
two extra slots. Okay. So be it. Um, definitely not a bad thing. Uh, well, nothing we can cook at a minute. Um, stranger. Yeah, it's a bit like that. <laughs> it's very much like that. Uh, red mage. Um, oh, where did I put my, uh, I dropped off a load of stuff somewhere, didn't I? Kind of. Don't put me up in random crap knocking around. I can't even carry most of it. You know what I mean? Um, I want to hang on to that, but. Yeah, one day. Gets more reputation. Yeah, he nods. Bless him. He's just like a, he's like a mushroom dude, isn't he? Basically. Um, right, so there's no point in me carrying this gasoline around. Get some an eye out for some alcohol, right? Might as well Let's save them carrying it around. Right, okay, we've, 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 you know, clawed our way through a bit of progress here, folks. We got to the, into the second area, I guess. Um, so we've got random stuff to the south. Peter X's house. Uh, and then Wolf's camp, which I guess, I guess technically is our main quest. Um, there's another entrance to the old woods there. Don't know how important that is. And technically, we can just wander all the way around the silent forest here. Which I guess probably that's the best thing for us to do at the minute. So, let's just start getting to it, I guess. Yeah, it is. The, the lighting is very, uh, very nicely done. Indeed, Red Mage. Oh, that random crazy people. Uh, only... Th oh, what the hell? The pig shed. Okay. Um, our hideout there. We've got still supplies there. So is it like... Do we need to like go and transfer them all over down here? Or I don't know what the best thing to do about with anything is. Oh, no. Someone trying to start a fight with us. Oh my god. Oh my god, we've died again. <laughs> I need some better weapon. I can't even win like a fair fight on full health. Uh, I don't, I'm obviously not very, I'm not very good at this game, to say the least. Um, but there seems to be very little consequence of dying, so it's just like, okay, let's just... Once more into the breach. Oh, I need to step on those, obviously. As soon as I can pick them up. Yeah, you seem to be, uh, be able to like attack way better than you can. They hit harder, seemingly, and uh. I don't know how I died or somewhere around here. I don't know. I've lost that stuff. Never mind, though. 
Um, and, uh, yeah, I don't know. They, they just attack way quicker. That's, that's how it's supposed to be, but... turn the power on to use a lever yeah i mean it's a bit sus anyway honestly <laughs> get the fuck out of here freak i warned you oh my god i'm fighting you now wherever you are death number uh, eight i think <laughs> am i uh am i missing something like some kind of subtlety of the combat i'm just not wrapping my head around properly at the minute i don't know oh yeah we freaking lost i need to, i do need to get back to where our backpack was because i lost my freaking watch yet again jeez louise uh <laughs> Yeah, not very good at this game. Um, it's, oh no, it's obviously not. Okay, it's showing us there. Yeah, yeah. Are this somehow at the corner here. I mean, you're gonna end up eventually with like red dots all over the map if you don't like pick up your stuff. But then on the other hand, it's uh, you know, if I find my watch, then it's like. I'm just going to die again, aren't I? So I'm going to lose it again. <laughs> oh, we found a train wreck, have we? Oh, yeah, there we go. Look. Yeah, it's getting slapped around again. Item's no longer usable. Neither is my life. Um. Um. I don't know, folks. I don't. Uh, I'm. I'm starting to struggle. <laughs> uh, okay. I guess we'll put our logs in here. Um, is this fuel in there? There we go. Okay. I think I need to turn that on. The, uh, I will say the controls are not, they're not intuitive. But that could also just be an excuse. Um. Right, did I, where, I stored stuff in here. I believe somewhere. Do I sell all the stuff I've stored? I think I might have, actually. Probably. I'm going to assume so. Um, okay, let's... Uh, let's see if we can find... Yeah, they've got the red dots everywhere. <laughs> Seeing if we can find our stuff again, I guess. Um, okay, that's like the main entrance into there, but that's not 
where we want to be, really. Aha! Oh, jeez. Yeah, I don't... I don't know what the, the technique to fight is. It's not, uh... It's obviously, uh, um, not that. I guess I should just not be going this way for now. I've no idea, folks. Uh, I feel like I, um... I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing, honestly. I guess maybe that's the that's the idea of the game. You're not you're not supposed to know what you've been, you know, supposed to be doing. Um, Uh, it's another uh, one of our backpacks. Oh. Oh, someone's fighting something. There you are. Oh, I can f fight them. I've ki Honestly, I've killed a few of them sometimes. It's just. Oh, is that a wolf? Oh, jeez. Let's try again. Kill that rando. Okay, there we go. So they stay dead. They still, they stay injured, seemingly, which I guess is technically to my advantage. They got a freaking watch. Thank God for that. And a flyer for what? Uh, for the pig farm, I guess. Because <laughs> they need flyers, don't they? <laughs> oh, talk to the mirror. What the hell? You are one ugly bastard. I guess you got what you deserved. Okay. I don't know if that's appropriate. Wow. Wonderful. Lovely, lovely, charming people we're meeting here. Um. I wonder. I'm going to just try this. Um. Let me put the watch in our hot bar there. We can, uh not lose it when we die you can say not me oh yeah we've got that random lever haven't we yeah of course if we turn the generator on okay let's try this it looks sort of sus as all hell but Right, various cables protrude from this contraption. Some of them run through the door to the outside. There is a lever and a red button on the panel. Um, the motion range of the lever is limited by a provisionally attached plate. Indeed. A uh, note is glued to the casing. Okay, let's read the note then. Set the voltage using the lever. The lock is set to a voltage that paralyzes the, the sew for a moment. Around 15 seconds. Procedure. Uh, the lever operator positions it in the middle. The feeder gives a sound signal. The operator then pushes the button and the feeder feeds the sew. Uh, repeat until the feeding is complete. Remember, the sew is, your co is our common good. Do not remove the lock. Okay. So move the lever into place and then press the button. A short circuit, okay. Ah, I see. I guess I want to turn it off for a second, right? Oh, I need to wait a bit so we can use it again, okay. 
Wow, pig heads, lovely. So I look at the smell of these dismembered heads. It seems they've been here for quite some time. Because I need to cut, not only to cut the cables. Touch these cables now. Okay, I need to, all right, so switch the generator off. Reattach those cables. Okay. And you know what? And I'll probably actually should just explore this area for a minute before I start messing around with stuff. Ah, repair the cables. I need some wire. Okay. I have the required resources very, very well. So we have some kind of like monster piggy in here that we need to deal with. I see no other way in this way. Okay, so we need to wait till we can uh, find some wire to reattach those. Okay. Very well. Um, I'm just going to hop over here and just head to the northwest a little bit just so we can get to like, maybe the edge of the map, see if there's anything over here. And we might actually already be there by the looks of it. Yeah. Oh, random body. This poor bastard probably died of starvation. Okay. That's nice. That's this guy. This scrap metal. Oh, oh dear. Oh, dear. oh God. Ah, it's locked. I could open it with a lockpick. Do we have a lockpick at a minute? I think we might. We do. Oh, look who it is. Uh, okay. Um, can we eat the bread, maybe? There we go. Although what it does, I don't know. It's not. It's not healing us. <laughs> I did it on time. All right, we've got just about an hour, about an hour and a quarter left of today's stream. Um. Oh, fuck off. Um. Oh, jeez. I've just killed us again. Oh, my God. I think I might have. Yeah, we're about to die. Never mind. So we're going to just get a little bit further home, and then I can less distance to come back to our body. This poison doesn't kill you. It just knocks your hit points all the way down. Okay, I'll have a little look in here. I'd love to harvest those mushrooms, but that's uh, certainly not an option. This pig's going to kick off. Don't come any closer. Oh, God, you know what that means, don't you? Well, I think to actually, if I if I get a light source, I can give myself a free heal, can't I? I don't really want to use. Uh... Okay, 
Okay, well, F Monday. Oh, what? Okay. Right. Does that not count as a light source? Or is that currently working? I don't know. I swear to God, this game is very confusing. Um. Yeah, I've activated that ability, but I guess it's the flare doesn't count as a light source. Oh, days. Good day. I've lost track now. Is that eight, nine? I don't know. No, it's not. It's not time, isn't it? So I guess we just wait here. Go and get our stuff there tomorrow. Um, we've got uh, any more gasoline? I think we do. Do we? Uh, probably lost a bunch of stuff though. Um, yeah, we lost all those nails we picked up as well. Uh, um, if I stuck, stick that in there, I'm going to forget about it, aren't I? Um, ah, oh, what's this? Ration stamps. Okay. What's ringed there? A full pack of something. I'm sure that'll have some significance at some point, I guess. Okay, I guess we're just chilling here for a minute. Um, okay, no, nothing to mushroom up. And no nails to repair anything. Okay, we're just going to stand here for a minute. Well, it's definitely a, a very original game. Like I say, I've played games with similar mechanics, like similar top-down down view and like movement, you know, crafting and inventory management and survival kind of mechanics, but nothing quite like this put all into one game. Um, and also like the narrative, the vibe. What's going on? Nobody knows. It's all... Uh, it's all very weird. Um. Oh god, here we go. Come in. You want some? You're just smashing up things up, are you, buddy? We'll fight you if you want. Uh, little piece of wood. Oh. oh my god, ganging up on us. <laughs> Can't even survive the night. <laughs> uh. I wonder, are we even, are we even really making progress? <laughs> it's, it's, it doesn't... 
it feels like we're kind of just fudging our way through the game rather than actually like playing the game as it's meant to be played i don't know i really don't know this point um uh, I guess we'll just pick up our stuff from us being dead on the floor. Um, can't sell the bell. I guess we just hang on to that. Um, bread seems to be useless, as far as I can tell. Uh... <laughs> have those bottles um value 20 all right might as well send shotgun shells i can't use those at the moment um i might as well sell some matches as i'm just that carting around for no reason um at least you don't lose your reputation do you so we are technically making progress all right let's uh again get back out there Yeah, give me those mushrooms. That's what I need. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't mind. It's, it's but if if that's the thing, if it's only if if we reach a point, uh, red mage, where it's um, it gives a little bit. Do you know what I mean? Um, then uh, fair enough. But if it's like the whole, if we've got to progress through the whole game, just like you know, dying five times for every enemy we kill. It's going to be a bit, you know, yeah. Okay, so we came down here, didn't we? Right. There we go. There's all our stuff. Uh, round two. So they don't seem to heal. God, the pig's getting in, in on it with us. Die again. Okay, cool. We got him. Pitchfork. Okay. We'll probably rock that for a minute. I like we've picked up the pitchfork, but the pitchfork's actually still on the floor. <laughs> I think I'll, I'll tag the pigo, the, the pigos, <laughs> the the pigs are a second there, and it didn't seem to upset them too much. Okay, a uh, bunch of stuff. Oh, my, oh, and the pig just came up behind us and killed us. Okay, let's uh, head back over there. Um, I keep the mushrooms, maybe I did. Um, they've got an actual s s place that's like halfway decent storage. Yeah, this this will do, I guess. Oh, I won't really will it, but ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Um. Let's just sell those two in a minute. Right, not enough fuel. Okay, no worries. Doesn't matter. We'll come back to that. Right, okay. Let's, uh... Let's try again. Did 
Yeah, Red Mage. I guess he wanted revenge, didn't he? I didn't, didn't think about it. Are they? You forget oh no! My God, it's uh. There you go. Stupid thing! I'm not trying to fight you, buddy. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to play the game. I'm trying. <laughs> Not regular, regular meat. Looks very rotten. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Oh, that's a bit clumsy. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What's going on here? Oh, wow! Oh my God! It's the, it's the giant pig. It's a giant peak. That must be with tentacles coming out of it. I don't know. Either way. Okay, right. Well, I don't think I can mess around with that at the minute. To say the least. Oh, this guy. I told you we had it coming. Oh, can we be friends? Who in the flying fuck goes there? Or break your legs. Oh my god, it's always something, isn't it? Oh, murder, mur be murdery murderers then, I guess. Oh dear. Oh, oh, our, uh... Oh, oh, jeez. There we go. Okay. My God. Too much stuff now. Okay. <laughs> Right, okay, uh, let me, let me go and drop some stuff back at the base, I guess. I'll come back for that stuff. Thank God. <laughs> uh, it, it is, the whole game is kind of stressful, which I think is meant to be the point of the game. Um, Red Mage is like... The complete opposite of, <laughs> uh, Peggle, uh, for example. <laughs> um, right, can I... Use my special ability to heal, get a free heal. Yes. There we go. So we're mothing it up now. God, the heal is slow, though. Yeah, you're not any tougher than the random enemies, which I guess that's a good thing, isn't it? Um, oh, there you go. That's our free heal. Um, I should turn this freaking generator off, shouldn't I? That's what I should have done. Wasting gasoline. Um, Tractor door. Right, okay. Um Okay, let's cook this meat and mushrooms.
Okay, that's ticking along. Got a lot of nails, haven't we? I'm trying to tidy this place up a bit. Oh, is there, is there even any point? Several times now, we've been in our hiding in, in our little house at night time with our light, with our special substance gas, keeping us alive, and then random randos just busting and murder us. So it's like, is what's the? Is there any point in wasting the resources on boarding up your place? Do you know what I mean? Right? Do you, know, do you see what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. I've literally no idea. But uh, what I want to do, though, is see if we can repair. Um, okay, you can only repair the workbench, can't you? Okay. Excellent. And that. Oh, you need scrap metal for that. It seems b the pitchfork does seem better than the little nail board thing. I'll say that. It does seem to be. Um, do I have any scrap metal over here? Nope. I do not. That's kind of an issue, isn't it? Guess we'll stash it until we uh do something with it. No point in carrying it around if it's all busted up, is there? Right, okay. Um let's go back over there, try and get some more stuff. Yeah, definitely, definitely Red Mage. It's just, um... I don't know. There should be, like... I feel there should be more of a penalty for dying, but then also... If there was, I'm not sure if I'd be able to get through the game. A rear-view mirror. Interesting. So we found a fan belt, a rear-view mirror, and a steering wheel. Are we slowly building up to making some kind of, uh... Some kind of vehicle for us to get around on. Or are they all going to be things that somebody else needs at some point? Right, okay, so as far as I can tell, this is, like, we've cleared out the pig farm. Um, the exception being that g giant freaky pig, which I think we have, is related to the switch uh, and doing whatever in that regard. Um, but we need some electrical wire, not just a piece of little metal wire to make a lot of pigs, some actual electrical wire. So it looks like that's the extent of what we can do for now. Um, let's uh, get out of here, I guess. And uh, if we need to come back here, then we we will at that time. Um, okay, so for now, I guess we just head south. I don't see any reason why not to. I mean, it's almost night time, but as it has, like, you know, you're going to die wherever and then 
it makes that much difference where we are, Joe. <laughs> um, I don't know. There's something I'm just failing to understand about the nuance of this game. But um, if so, I don't I don't know what it is. Okay, I've got some savages. I want three of them. Oh my god. I shouldn't fight though. Leave them to it. Another savage here. On his own. I'm going to take one. Okay. Not too bad, was it? The silo. Okay. <clears throat> Someone's kicking off over there. Mannequin. An old headless mannequin. Oh, what's going on now? Oh, a gramophone. Um. Okay, is that what's making the the music? Can we like maybe just turn it off? <laughs> ah, right. Look, it's falling over. Okay, I see. Right, dead rats, eh? Excellent. Scrap metal, we need that. Okay, the rest of this stuff will have to wait. Oh, my God. Um. Uh, some night time is coming on. Got too much stuff anyway, so I suppose we should try and head back. I guess we want those dead rats. I don't really know. Yeah, I mean, you say we must return to our hide hideout before nightfall. The only real consequence of that, surely, is we die, which is no real consequence at all. That is to say. Oh, jeez, what the? Okay, exploding corpse. Um, <laughs> it's, oh, new location, camp. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, jeez. It's no longer usable, no doubt. Um, we are almost no longer usable. <laughs> uh, we uh, just use that. I think we can. I have to. I have to uh, place it there. Never mind. Okay. Uh, all right. It's night time. We're about to get effed in the eye. Let's 
something's after us. I mean, I don't really know uh, where we are. Oh, are we dead? Never mind. <coughs> Alright, let's uh, sell him some junk. I don't sell him the mushrooms, do we? I need the scrap metal. We lost the scrap metal. Never mind. Uh, oh, we've got. So I'm sure we stashed some stuff we can uh, probably sell. Let's cook our uh, mushroom lot. Right, we're selling the stones. I don't know if they're worth anything. I guess we'll sell them the ammo because there's nothing I want to do with that at the minute. Uh, and the potatoes and the meat and the battery. Yeah, stones aren't worth anything. <laughs> uh,. I guess I'll probably save the pitchfork. Although, uh. Just sell, I guess it doesn't matter because I sell it to him. I don't really care. Uh. Those. And the ammo. Right, oh, we've got enough, enough for another cloth, haven't we? What else do we need? We need something else with that, don't we? All right, there we go. Rope. Well, Which he doesn't have any. Okay, that's unfortunate. So let me um Stash that cloth because you know what's going to happen. I'm just going to uh, die and lose it out in the middle of nowhere. Um, that's where we just place it there. Right, okay. Um, where are we going? Uh, there's a bunch of stuff down there, wasn't there? Um, oh, that was, uh, oh, was I almost back at camp anyway when I died? Maybe. Oh my god. The, c the combat in this game is very awkward. We'll uh, sell that. Ah, he's already gone. Okay, never mind. Yeah, that's the uh, the Dark Souls one, isn't it? I don't know. I think I don't know if that's one that I've put on there through uh, uh, Frank Face, or whether that's uh, one of Ryan's specifically. Or, uh, like an actual emote. Oh my God, uh, I don't know where my stuff is. Oh, I'm at I'm at some random rock somewhere. Okay, let's have a look around here, I guess. Oh, a knife. Okay, that's cool. Gasoline, metal pipe. Chinese stone. Oh my god, we... Oh my oh my god. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh my god, okay, there's no even point in trying to fight them, is there? Oh. 
Okay, let's, let's just try and get back where we were, so when I die, I won't be as far away. There we go. Just let me kill me. I mean, loading times were pretty good. There we go. That stuff should just be... Oh my... Oh, he's all... Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Was someone else keeping track? I think that's probably up to like 12 or 13 now. <clears throat> Oh, he's just, he just left. He had enough. He was like, oh, I've killed you twice. <laughs> right. Um... I'll stick some gasoline in here somewhere. Just get it out of the inventory. Don't know that we need it for any, anything else. God damn, we've only got 40 minutes, guys. It's uh, flown by today. There we go. We can try the knife out, I guess. This doesn't interrupt enemies' attacks, but, you know, I don't think that's either, either here nor there at the moment. Oh. Oh, that's that's throwing it. Okay. Huh? How do I just do a normal uh, n not throw it attack? Can you use this melee all thrown? I'm sorry, he just wants to throw it. Okay, weird. That's not very helpful then if you can't actually use it as melee. Oh. I don't know. Uh, let's just stash it and sell it next time we die. Right, okay. Um So we had another death just down here. Got some stuff to pick up apparently. That's back to the rock formation where those guys were. They've gone away? Unlikely. Oh. Yeah, where you at? Hmm. Oh. Oh god, he's got a spear or something. The range on uh, this little. Uh, he's trying to throw rocks at me, this guy. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. I think. I'm not. I don't know. Unless. um. 
exploring every nook and cranny not nook and cranny but like each location is actually necessary to get through the game i don't know but i mean i'm sure there's bits and pieces up here that i didn't actually need to go to to get down to this area i could be wrong though um okay let me just go and get my stuff back remember well, you know it feels like the reason to explore is to get resources but resource you constantly like dying and dropping them so it's like it doesn't it's almost like it doesn't uh okay do we have a lot of pick me we do not i'm sure we don't um it's almost like the, the it feels to me at least that the game is not rewarding you for exploring it's penalizing you if if you suck at the game like i do um which you know is kind of an issue right where did i die What's around there, wasn't it? Where's my stuff? Yeah, I was fighting around there, wasn't I? I was literally like around there, I died. I don't know, that stuff might have vanished. Okay, anyway. I'm going to <laughs> I'm just gonna try and follow the the story, so to speak. Which is get, meeting up with the wolf man down here. And then he's gonna tell us how to get our key. Now, no doubt he's going to have us to doing some ra random running around to achieve that, but let's at least go and find out what he wants us to do to achieve that. Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't know what that was. Oh, I've made it down here, apparently. The cot to a cottage. Well, not exactly here, but... Okay, this looks hopeful. Yeah, wolf's camp. Uh, I can smell your stench from far away, meat. Yeah, no doubt, buddy. Uh, <laughs> um, I'll be damned. I barely believe my beautiful eyes. You made it. <laughs> I mean, we died like about 12 times to get here, bud. Uh, I need to admit, you're a quite resourceful piece of meat. Not really, bud. No, I feel like we're just fudging our way through it. Uh, the wolf smiles really in a row of sharp teeth. Time to get to the specifics. Follow the path located in the southwestern edge of the fo silent forest. You'll get to a village where you'll find a hag who reeks of chickens. Talk to her. Maybe you'll learn something interesting. Okay. Southwestern edge of the silent forest. Looking for a hag. The chicken hag. Um, be, but be on your guard, comrade. Don't let her deceive you with that kind face of hers. The selfish bitch is keeping something that does not belong to her behind the locked door in her house. Something I'm after. Bring me the key to that door, and I will tell you where to find the thing you lost. Okay. He's not even asking us to kick the door in and get the thing for him. He's just, you go get me the key to that door, and then I'll take care of the rest. Uh, is it fair, comrade? A key for a key? Huh, good. Now take off, get to work. Okay. Is there anything new to show him? No, not like it. Trade. Anything? Ah, he's got another... Um. He's got another toolbox. We have, like, nothing to give him, though, so... This doesn't really matter. Um, gossip? Looks like no one else will enlighten you. Listen. The inhabitants of our lovely village hold many, many secrets. Treasures they do not wish to share with anyone. The selfish, deceitful wretches. You think They think they're superior because they have hum human gobs. Okay. They're gobs, as in mouth. Um, they treat us like lepers. But do you know the what? The fuck them. We're buddies, aren't we? Uh, and them, they deserve to be punished, meat. 
Well, I'm at the point now, Mr. Wolfman, that basically anyone I just wander across, I'm mean, inclined to just attack. Um, because they just seem to attack me. So, uh, the Wolfman moves closer to me. Hear that squealing? It's one of their secrets. The, uh, the giant pig. Uh, the wolf grins, listening to the distant sound with great relish. Find that pig shed meat. Make that squealing stop and the treasure will be yours. Ah, uh, this is a little clue there. So if we do find the wire to use the lever properly to deal with that giant pig, we're going to get something good out of it. But also, how, how much does it matter? That's a good, good question. Right, southwestern edge. Look at, let's go look for the hag in this direction. Oh, oh, you can fuck off. Get out of here, bruh. Oh, fuck you, son. Okay, they're right. There we are. Road to the village. Okay, so we're heading south. Yeah, this is the road. Okay. The gutted pig. Oh my God. Exit. Oh, right, the pig that's hanging up there on the tree. Okay. This one's just, yeah, lovely. Uh, can I sit here? Uh, dead pet. Of course you can. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Are you a fan of this game? It seems, un unbeknownst to me, there seems a bit of hype around this game today because it was released for free on Epic Games. I had no idea. I'm brand new to this game. It was just gifted to me the other day. So we're like, so we're having a go at it. Uh, it's very random. Uh, but yes, welcome in there, dead pet. Um, right, I'm not... F but if you knew, know this game... I can't do that now. Can't look at our map, can we? Okay. If you're aware of this game... Uh, and you know about it... Prepare to see some terrible gameplay. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, and I, not, I feel I'm not very good at the game. But if you want to have a giggle or... <laughs> uh, just have a little gander. You you, you uh, make yourself a home, my friend. Um... Yeah, if you've got any questions, let me know. Yes, my name is Isnib. You can call me Is. I, I do forget to say that sometimes. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know about a year, but you never played it. Oh, right. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. This is The Witch. Okay, it's... it's I'll tell you this, uh, Dead Pet. It's, um, it's very interesting. It's a very interesting game. I am terrible at it, though. Our woods are so beautiful this time of year. Okay. That's that's great. I'm, I'm looking to break into your house, my dear. Uh, honestly, <laughs> and, and steal some stuff from you. Unless I just kill her and oh oh, maybe that's not the old woman. Where's my meat? I should get two kilos of meat for this month. What? What, what even? Okay, so there's no, there's no map of this area. This is just its own self-contained area. If it ever tries to come back, I'm a fucking quack doctor. All oh, right, yeah, we we don't like that guy either, mate. Ah, burned doctor's bag. Oh. Interesting. Who are you? Can I speak to you? Get away from me. Or, what, you want to fight me to the death like everybody else in this town? In this forest? Um, who knows? Okay, um... God, it's quite the village, isn't it? He's been hiding in his cottage for the last couple of days. He'll end up like the others. That's the way it usually goes. Um, dead pet, you're terrible at most games. <laughs> That's fair enough. I, oh, I'm, I'm okay at some games. This, I'm really not very good at. The combat's real awkward. Uh, you know, maybe that's just... Uh, that's just me. Yeah, Red Mage on Epic Games. It's free right now. It's just a crazy coincidence we happen to be playing it. I can't imagine getting good at this game, uh, Sleep Mick. But, you know. But it is what it is. Right. Um, the villagers turn their heads away from me. I don't think I'm welcome here. <coughs> I don't care. I'm going to rob you and take your stuff. Oh, wait. Is this a little base for us? Oh, oh, jeez, what's going on here? I'll take the gasoline. Oh, 
Oh, I can hear you. Yeah, I'm, I'm just coming to take your stuff, buddy. Don't worry. Wow, I'm not just going to murder someone who's, you know, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess that was the guy they were talking about. Yeah, barricade himself in his house. Okay. That's interesting. Okay. Um... Who are you? Just passing through. Just here to rob the hag of her key. That's all that's all I'm here to do, don't worry. I'm not here to start any fights. It's not a problem. Oh. And just got a couple of random beds. Okay. Got a wardrobe. Got a battery and the siphon. Okay. Interesting. That's maybe related to the vehicle. I wouldn't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. I like that as a beat em up game. I find it tough, though. It's not... It's not quite Streets of Rage, is it? Okay, so the house is basically empty. Uh, okay. Gasoline and bread. Oh, large hole in the ground. Uh, it's quite a wide tunnel. There are finger marks on the ground. It must have been dug out using bare hands. I wonder where it leads. Screw it. Let's go for it. Uh, oh, oh. Oh. How curious. It leads us back here to our base. That's, well, the safe house in the South Forest. Okay. How very strange. I wasn't expecting that at all. Um, actually, literally opened up a shortcut for us. Um, okay, let me... Um, not too long before night's here, but... I guess I should maybe stash some stuff. Oh, I've got no room to stash anything. Uh, oh my god. Okay. okay, cool. That's good to know. I thought, I just, I was like, is this going to be some weird secret place here? It's not. And I'll assume if I go back through this, this is going to take us right back to where we were in the village. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. I hear you. Are you the hag? Who are you? Get away from me. Okay. I need to be like that. I've got some shrooms. Um. chickens Maybe this is her house and she smells like chickens I mean does this sound like a, I feel like you know chicken like cooked chicken oh my god you smell good <laughs> this has got to be hasn't it look at look, there's all chickens everywhere ah the wooden floor is sticky with chicken feces and feathers lovely Chicken lady, talk. Hello. Quince me, her eyes full of suspicion. She hugs her chickens possessively. <laughs> Better keep their hands off my hens, you bloody scoundrel. Hello, pleased to meet you. 
The old lady puts one of the hens to her ear, mumbling under her breath. After a moment, she calms down. I've seen my share of things, lived through many a war, but nothing like this. Lord be my witness, is a cursed land ain't a place for men, ain't a place for hens. Show the plastic chick, maybe. Hell's bells, where did you get it? Where did you find it? The old lady seems disturbed. The hens fell silent. I can feel the tension in the air. Holy mother, it's Janik's little hen. A gift from, from me. My little brother. A couple of days ago, he got mad. I told him, stay. You're not one of them brainy fellas. <laughs> you know nothing. But he wouldn't listen, and off he went to that other fellow. Here, take this. He went to see this fellow. See him. He never came back. Uh, the lady shoves a crumbled photo into my hand. Okay. Right, okay. Uh, a bunch of people. The woman trembles violently. The hen on her shoulder struggles to maintain balance. You're all I have, my little sisters. I'm very curious. Um, have you not played it yet, Red Mage? I've never played the Plague Tale. I've heard it's alright, though. All right, then show the, the road photo. Oh, I remember this place. I do. It's been six years since I've been here there last. This road used to lead to the other village. You could also take it to get to the city. Not that far from here. You won't get there now. These devilish trees have overgrown everything. Indeed. Uh, gossip? Poor Hanushka has lost her mind. A fellow knocked her up with this abomination. Oh my god. Even them mongrels tucked their tails and yelped when they saw it. I tell you. Poor soul. They burned her fellow with the shack and took the horror somewhere. Everyone got the jitters. Little wonder. What? The old lady smiles kindly, uh, bearing her three yellow teeth. Uh, it was a long time ago, but you remember it still, my little hen, don't you? This game is wild. Um, thank the Lord for our sow. Uh, sow, so? Sow. Sow, isn't it? For a female pig. Uh, poor, poor thing seems sickly, but she has more life in her than a lot of us, if you ask me. Only thanks to her, we've got something to put in the pot these days. Oh, my God. Okay. Holy mother. This creep again. May the devil take him and his blasted violin. The old lady turns red and starts to scream. Devil fucked your mother. Get away from me house. Okay. There's someone outside playing the violin. He's like, please, please don't do that. Okay, did it stop? Or down here? I'm sorry, it won't happen again. I don't care, buddy. It, it's not my fault. I know it doesn't sound too great. My violin, it's a bit broken. I won't play anymore, so sorry. And, um, sir, have you been in that hut, the chicken lady's hut? You're not afraid of her. You're brave. And have you seen her, the pretty lady? She's the most beautiful lady in the world. I w watched her through the cracks in the window. She changes when I watch her. Gets more beautiful. I play for her. I want her to be happy because she doesn't seem to be. The chicken lady locked her in that room. Oh. Maybe that's what the wolf man is after. The late, this beautiful lady. Locked in the room. Uh, she, she keeps her there. She envies her. She won't allow anyone to see her. Even me. She knows very well that during the last Kapula night, uh, Kapala? Kapala night. Kupala? Kupala night. I fished out the pretty lady's wreath from the river. Yes, sir. The chicken lady knows what it means. Oh, yes. I've become the pretty lady's husband. Uh, we walk hand, we will walk hand in hand, sir. I will play for her, Mr. Sir. I tried to re release her, but the chicken lady, she chased me off. She always does. I uh, also I looked for the second key at Mr. Jan's, but now he's disappeared. I don't know how to get into his house. Okay. So kind, so very kind. You're just like him, my daddy. But my papa has changed, mister. Just I like my mummy. 
They will not listen to me. They won't listen. They won't hear how sad I am, sir. Oh, but, sir, uh, am I not boring you, sir? Please, don't go. Please, hear me out. D don't go. Nervous grunting can be heard from beneath the tractor. Perhaps you can help me. Okay. Got, got, got this far. But please, please, find the key, good sir, to the pretty lady's room. That's what we're looking for. Uh, the chicken lady has it. Um, well, Mr. Jan also has it. I saw him recently near the well. Uh, he used to play with me. We threw rocks into the well, and l I looked into our reflections. We're making silly faces. Daddy used to say not to do it, uh, else my face will stay that way. Now the water in the well is always hazy. It shows these weird images. The well is here in the village. Maybe you'll find him there. He used to hang around it often. He stared into the well as if looking for something or someone. Uh, I must, I, uh, I must hide now. Hide from the chicken lady. Okay, new journal entry. I'll have a look at this in a minute. Uh, I will get to that place where they used to keep all the grain in the southwestern part of the silent forest. Yeah, we've been there. Okay. Why? Yeah, the silo. I don't know where he's going there. Uh, will you bring me the key if you find it? I promise to repay you somehow, me and the pretty lady. Hmm. Okay. So whether the chicken lady has the key, or this Mr. Jan who hangs by the round by the well has the second key. Two copies of the same key? I don't know. Seems to be the key to the room, a room in the chicken lady's house where she has imprisoned the pretty lady. Apparently. Now, the wolf wants the key to that room. Presumably, he wants the pretty lady. Presumably. Um, and he has offered to give us the, the key to... You know, the, the 21 key to the secret tunnel. Which is our overall main objective, seemingly. However, this the nervous musician guy... Who, you know, seems very, just equally sus as the wolf man, just in a different way... He's like, oh, yes, the pretty lady. I love her, and we're a couple, and I'm going to run off to the silo, and if you bring me the key instead, so I'll repay you somehow. I wonder if there's, like, a twist in the, um, the overall story, the direction of the story, about how we proceed. So I'd imagine you could still complete the game, regardless whether you give it to this guy, the key, which I don't know how we're going to get out. We'll come across that in a second. Or if we give it to the Wolfman. The Wolfman seems more dangerous, but he's also, like, the one who's actually gonna, said he's going to give us what we actually need to get out of this place. Um, we shall see. Anyway, uh, for now, let's listen to his gossip. Have you heard about the sow? Sow. Sow, yeah. Uh, the villagers keep that sow in the nearby pig shed. They call it the mother of all pigs. I've seen it. They say it's beautiful. No, it's not. Uh, <laughs> but I've never seen it. They don't allow me near her. They chase me off. They always chase me off. The little musician drops his gaze. Uh, maybe you'll see her, mister. If you manage to get inside, maybe you could take a wee piece of meat for me. I've never eaten a pig. And I've heard it's very tasty. Would you take some for me? Wow, you, bro, you're insane. Um, okay. His mission. So this is the photo of the doctor, as in the photo. I don't know if this doctor started chisel with us, but the, the what the chicken lady gave us. She says, "This is our doctor. Yes, he was just as brave and good as you are. He helped me. He's helping all of us. He gave me this beautiful mask so I could be healed of my afflictions. Maybe you have one too. Um, yeah, we were told to." We'd have to wear, who told us we had to wear a mask if we went somewhere? I think it, I think it was the wolfman who said, you better wear a mask if you want to go to the the wedding celebration. I can't remember, we went there anyway. Interesting. Uh, and showing the photo of the road. Mommy once told me about this, this road. She said people used to travel it. They would leave their houses and walk in during, walk it during the night. I was scared of this story. I was afraid mommy would uh, go out too and leave me behind. Oh, okay, bro. I don't want to make of any of that. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, 
yeah, the musician, well, the musician is, the musician's mother is friends with the doctor. Yeah, I mean, seems like a thing, doesn't it? Um, okay, so I guess we're still exploring for the minute. But the village never ends. Okay, so the locked door must be in somewhere in there. So soon we've got a few different options of, uh, Uh, two different options of where to get a key and two different options of what to do with the key i think it's fair enough to say that in this world nothing is as it seems so we shouldn't assume that that guy is a good guy and the wolf man is a bad guy i think it's just it is what it is isn't it make of it what we will pick up a note here we go uh burn a mix of herbs in the oven uh chamomile nettle and lovage lovage uh keep the patient warm twice a day one tablespoon of sauerkraut juice by mouth yeah that's okay that's the patient is it well we don't have any of that stuff so what are we gonna do charred body His arms and legs are bound with a chain oh, i guess we'll take the chain oven Curious. Curiouser and curiouser. Um, yeah, we're, yeah, 1001. We're, uh, we're slowly making progress. We just got to the village. Uh, I have no idea what's going on, though. Uh, whether I've missed anything. Or whether we should even be here at the minute. I don't know, but here we are. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing anywhere in there at the moment. If there's any, if there's any need to go in there. Um. Anyway, we'll finish poking around our house for a minute, I guess. So maybe talk to her again and be like, yo, what's, we, who's that, who's that lad outside? Uh, said the next little hen with an odd little shrug. I wish I could find a fat little bug. Okay, she's coming to stop. Uh, I've not seen you. The old lady stops hunting. What do you want? Oh, I guess I guess nothing. Okay, random map. Location already marked. The pig shed. Oh yeah, we um. I I picked up a bunch of. I uh, got a couple of journal entries, didn't I? I'm trying to look at my items there. Doctor's instruction, all sorts of random stuff. Uh, a journal. Here we go. Um, right, day nine. The wolf's offer. That's going to bring him the key to the locked room in the house of the hag that reeks of chickens. In exchange for this uh favor, he will help me retrieve a key. A key for a key seems quite fair. I shall find the hag in the village in the southwestern edge of the silent forest. Indeed, the chicken lady's brother. The old lady who lives with chickens told me the plastic chick belongs to her brother, who went missing a few days ago. She gave me a photo of the person she saw him last with, the doctor. So he's probably dead, right? Because you know, we found the, that plastic chick at the beginning of the game, didn't we? Uh, it's the local doctor. I recognise the fucker. <laughs> uh, a strange boy. I met a boy in the village. He told me that the chicken lady keeps the pretty lady locked in her house. The boy really wants to see her, but the old woman won't allow it. He asked me to find the key to her room. Uh, he will wait for me in his hideout in a grain silo in the southwestern part of the Silent Forest. Yeah, we've um, already been there. But he's not there at the minute. He's uh, just chilling under the tractor at the minute. Um, um, key to the chicken lady's locked room. The boy revealed to me that we'll find a spare key to the locked room in the chicken lady's house inside the village well. Sounds absurd. But it's the only lead I have. Um, the local doctor's photo. The boy with the violin recognised the local doctor on the photo given to me by the chicken lady. He claims he's a good man. He's supposedly helping the villagers. 
He helped me too, and then he snatched my fucking key. <laughs> Indeed. Um. Okay. Steal our stuff. Oh, a toolbox. Well, la da Okay, so that's where she's... Yeah, she's been trapped in there. Somebody can't smash that down. Okay, another steering wheel. Uh, yeah, have got too much stuff at the minute, haven't we? Never mind. Right, egg, say. Chicken egg and a red egg. Again, can't carry any of that. Guess we could come back through here, maybe. Um, right, okay. Um, keep exploring, I guess. There's some tape there as well. Oh, God. Oh, what's that? The cross. Okay. Interesting. Um,. I guess we'll come back in a minute. Um, Boogerman game. Uh, oh my god, I don't know if we've even heard of that. Fate 64. Of course you can. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Uh, welcome in. My name's Isnib. You can call me Is. Everybody does. Uh, are you a fan of this game? Uh, or have you, uh, are you just checking it out? Because it's obviously it's free today on Epic Games. And I had no idea about that. It's such a weird coincidence. But yeah, welcome in, friend. Any questions? Let me know. Uh, it all seems to be blocked from the other side. Okay. Very well. This not really uh, help us out at the minute. Well, I wish I had more stamina. <laughs> I like the idea. Yeah, you know, I like a stamina meter in a game, but or I'm just kind of assuming that I'm giving the game the benefit of the doubt that this, uh, this, you know, ev everybody in this. Uh, in this world kind of i guess it's the evil in the air the, the weirdness they have like really poor cardio just like you know you should be able to like run for a little bit more than this and not be out of breath do you know what I mean? <laughs> um right so i think this is the entrance of where we entered from so let me have a little look, have a look in this direction. There's uh, crops here by the looks of it. I assume there's probably nothing over there. No. Yeah, I, th I think he's like a. Yeah, I think he uh before maybe all this went down, he was um. He was smoking a pack a day. <laughs> uh, it's going very well. You love this game, excellent. If. It feel for, you know, obviously, uh, I, I want to avoid spoilers because it's my first time playing it. But um, I I'm kind of struggling with the gameplay. I'm not sure like what I haven't really figured out what the best thing to be doing at any given moment is. Who are you? I'm I'm just I'm just passing through, buddy. Get away from me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just being nosy. Um. Yeah, no, it's it's a fantastically pre presented game. Uh, the vibe is kind of unlike anything I've else I've really played. But uh, yeah, well, nice emote there. Like <laughs> uh, yeah, 
Excellent. Uh, but yeah, I'm we'll having some fun with it. I, like I said, I'm struggling a little bit. I'm glad we're playing on normal because um, I uh, I've died like about 15 times so far. Okay, and this is where we entered, wasn't it? Yeah. So, it, random person. Yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. Wash your clothes in that dirty ass water there. Yeah, that's gonna help, isn't it? Also, not bother. Uh. <laughs> Okay, I guess that's not the well of the village. That's just a random well. Okay, that's can I go that way. Okay, a random map. The pig shed. Um. Okay, so <laughs> I guess. Oh, okay, and that's locked. How much we can do with that until we get the code? Right, okay. Guess we'll come back to this later. Um, um Okay, excellent. Fate, I'm glad it's not just me. Put it that way. Because I'm not I'm not like a gamer god. I'm not real good at like, you know, hardcore retro games or anything, or even the smartest. But I have been playing video games my whole life and I'm not like I'm not an idiot, do you know what I mean? I, I know I've played a few games, you know what I'm saying? Um But yeah, I've died I've died a lot. Um And I believe like the hardest setting on this is like you've got you've permadeath, isn't it? You've got one death and that's it. You're done. Uh Which uh, I guess maybe if you're like very used to the game and you know what is going on with it and what the best thing to do is, then you might be alright, but I'm not there yet, and I don't know that I will be. What now? Hello? Lock need the key. Get the fuck away from my home. Rah! That's locked as well. There is no more meat. The sow is starving. She gives no pigs. Okay, well, what do you want me to do about it? Get or I'll lose Antek. I'll let Antek loose. Um, maybe I should fight Antek. Is pet a doggo? God, that sounds scary. Okay, never mind. Let's leave that for a minute. Moving on. Um. Um. No, no, yeah, that's sorry. That's yeah, conflux coins. I don't know what that is. Is that is that some kind of Bitcoin? Got some uh digital currency never even heard of it fake no no that's the that's the name of our discord server uh, <laughs> no thousand and one no um i mean i guess like say if you were very used to the game and you um oh hello what's going on there okay just bang on the window there all right enjoy um you could get the hang of it and i'm sure it's like a massively long game but imagine if you got to the end and you're like just had an accidental death and you're just like oh oh there we go. that's 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 done and dusted isn't it okay so yeah we'd already been here hadn't we um this edge here yeah because that's where we found the uh the doctor's burnt bag this is a random person so this must be the, the village well Right, if I want a long, sturdy rope or chain, I should be able to descend it. And we do indeed have a chain. Okay, so let's head down into the well. Um, uh, never, Scotty. A yeah, conflux coin. I never, never know that. I don't, I don't, I don't follow crypto, fate. I don't know anything about it. Uh, but yeah, is it worth anything? I hope they don't try and sue us, claiming that's their name. We just worked hard. That was one of like about 50 different possible names we could have gone for all right so this well is looking pretty freaking dry not a drink any liquid around in in this place but all right, a torch and a flare i can't really carry any of it i guess i'll maybe i'll drop these rocks these rocks are worthless aren't they i assume Let 
Maybe I should pull one of these torches out. That's only slightly disturbing. Hello? <laughs> Uh, oh, okay. Uh, I guess we'll try this way first. Okay, that's dead end. Um, it's not worth anything, Faye. <laughs> All right, there we go. That makes me feel better. No, not not for the guys who got tried to get the crypto up and running. Here's the thing, I don't really understand crypto. I mean, I understand the essence of it, but I don't understand how how it will actually kind of take over the world. Because I've I've seen people be like crypto, it you know they're like all in, they're like all in. They just have spent, they've just bought all the Bitcoin, uh, and they just have no money. They have no real money. They just have Bitcoin. Um, but then I see other people be like, okay, no, it's it's a fad. It's not going to last. Um. That being said, whether it works or not, surely it's only like, like the main, the main cryptocurrencies that have the most people invested in it. Which, I, if I understand, Bitcoin is the number one, and is it Ethereum that's number two? So I feel like anything that is like not one of those two is like, is it really gonna? Get, is it going to do anything? I don't know. I don't know anything about it. It's just I don't have any real any any fiat money, let alone crypto money. So <laughs> it doesn't concern me. Do you know what I mean? Um, oh, Scott, you could rally the producers to demand that there's a nightmare playthrough. Nah, wait. Well, I mean, I mean, you could try, but. Okay, this well is like unlike any well I've ever not ever ever gone like climbing down wells before, of course, but needs needs to clean out or some shit. I mean, no. um, I do like the lighting effects, like uh, you know, your like your line of sight and how you can see, you know it's varied by what you can actually see and do. Oh. Oh, geez, this isn't good. Oh, turn to the surface. Okay. Well, that doesn't sound good. Whatever that is. Um. Now I can't return to the surface until I found the co uh, the key, right? Well, at least we know how to get back up there. Gotta find this key somewhere. Oh, 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 wow, wow, wow. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Oh, God. Freakish. Anyway, before we rudely interrupted that, I'm almost dead. <laughs> uh, can I? In fact, can I use my my moth ability? If I press the right freaking button, of course. Seriously? Oh, there you go. It's working. Right. I don't know if it counts for carrying a torch. I think. Oh no, it has to be an electric light source, doesn't it? Oh my god. Which we don't have, so it doesn't really matter. Anything over there. 
So if we um if I come across any more monsters, so we have to come, retrace our steps, shall I say. I'm surprised I managed to kill that one creature there, honestly, but I'm going around in circles, aren't I? My god. I think we've got anything to heal ourselves in a minute, do we? Yeah, pills don't really seem to heal you, though. From what I've seen. I guess we could just bosh them anyway. And like bread as well. It's just, at least it doesn't even pretend that it heals. Uh, <laughs> uh. Oh, it did. Okay, I'm sure we did, took some pills before and they didn't really like, do anything. Never mind. Okay. I'm feeling like we've gone everywhere. Aside from that monster, I don't see that there's any key or anything. Unless it, that monster was, like, carrying it. And it was like, we well, didn't say a key, but... The, the small plastic doll. I don't know. Oh, yeah, yeah. Weird. You're not not creepy at all. Take the meat, because we can uh, do something with that, can't we? I don't know. Are we maybe we are just going back up to the surface. I've definitely not seen any key down here, and I feel that I've co covered every every pathway. Let's just try it, because it's going to take us up to a different spot, isn't it? So, presumably. Oh. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, God damn it. Plastic chickens. Oh, okay. Come on, those. Uh. And a dog tag. I can't really read what it says, but never mind. Okay, let's open this up. All right, eggs in the oven. Ah, key covered in chicken feces. This must be the key then, right? Right, okay. This must be the spare key, I assume. Bro, you can... Is <laughs> complete lack of cardio is astounding. Right, okay, so that's presumably the key. So we've got a choice now of we can either give that to uh, the wolf guy or head to the grain silo. Uh, and I'm inclined to give it to the wolf guy, honestly, because he's going to give us the key we need to get out of this place. Um, which I assume there would be another way around it if you gave it to the, uh, the grain silo kid, but the musician. Yeah, they're just there. Um, lost inventory there, apparently. God knows what that could be.
Auf. Kommt dann an. Alright, bro. I think it's very disrespectful calling us meat, but um, it's trying to fight with the doctor. Well, well, I know this quack. Uh, a non-entity, third-rate witch doctor, useless fucking clunker, but he still managed to screw you over with that key, eh, comrade? Indeed. Um, show him the key then. As I produce the key, the wolf's pupils widen with excitement. Well, meat, I didn't think you could succeed. I'm impressed. Time for your reward. You'll find that quack thief here. But he locked himself away from the world, and he won't let anyone in. So I don't know if this information will be of any use to you, meaty. Uh, what the fuck are you looking at? I promised that I'd tell you where to find him, and I did. No, you promised me a key. You said you'd give me a key. They'll tell you about to get, uh, you'll be able to get there. That's something else, isn't it? <laughs> Burst out with the laughter. He's an asshole. Get out of my sight, meat. I have important business to attend to. If you're interested in continuing our wonderful relationship, look for me in the southeastern edge of the old woods. That's the east, isn't it? I predict a tasty future together. Wolf sinks his hands in the deep pockets of his coat. Here. Deliver this to that insane old bitch as a way... Uh, as a weight of thank you for her beautiful sister. Um, a, a chicken's head. Okay. May, or maybe not. Uh, the wolf throws the head of a chicken under my feet. As I lift my gaze, I realize that the wolf is gone. Um. <laughs> right. That's the. That's my possibly my main takeaway of it. I, don't get me wrong, Ryan. I like uh, a stamina bar in uh, any kind of like action-based game, um, but his his just seems very limited. Like I don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, right, he's disappeared, has he? All right, okay, and he's got random crates that. Ah, oh, the combinations for those, huh? <laughs> Uh, okay, so... He's like, ha-ha, I'll tell you where he is. He didn't even tell us where he was, though, did he? He just said, oh, come and see me, if you come and see me again in the old woods. That's not helpful. In any way, shape, or form. Um... <laughs> uh... Let me have a look at my journal for a second. Uh, unless I have to go and take the chicken head to her, I don't know. Um, uh, I decided to give the key to the chicken lady's room to the wolf. As agreed, he told me that we'll find the doctor in the eastern part of the old woods. Okay. Unfortunately, the doctor doesn't let anyone in. I need to find a way to make an appointment. Uh, the wolf gave me a disembodied chicken head. He told me to give it to the chicken lady as a thank you for the wonderful sister. All right. I mean, whether he's trying to eat her or be get a bit rapey, I don't know, but... He's clearly after the the lady, you know, that she's got locked away. Uh, I don't know what he means by that, but it can't be good indeed. Uh, the wolf's disappearance. The wolf didn't talk, want to talk to me anymore. He grunted that he had something urgent to take care of and rushed off. If this wolf brain thinks that he will get rid of me so easily, then he's mistaken. Uh, he mentioned he'll be staying in the south southeastern part of the old woods. This is where I'll find my uh, companion. Yeah, um, that's it. Right, okay, so I guess we are essentially... I'm sorry, wrong button again. Uh, we're essentially heading over here into the old woods to the east. So the, uh, so the doctors hold up somewhere to the east. The, um... The, uh, wolf is somewhere to the southeast, so... I guess technically we just head over there. Now, I didn't even check this route to see if we could get through. So I guess that's what I need to do next. Now the chicken head. It seems a bit fucked up to give it to that old the old chicken lady, doesn't it? Oh god, we've like gone way over on the stream, guys. So I think we need to leave it here. Um But that's what we'll do tomorrow. Uh either head back to the village or just try and head through here. 
I'm sure we'll be able to work it out. We're, we're definitely making progress. Um, so do I just exit main menu? And it auto, auto saves? I assume it's auto saving. Uh, it's your interest done to make you you save any unsaved progress. That's down last save three minutes and 10, 11 seconds ago. Yes, then. Um, cool. Okay. Um, well, that was interesting. Um, ah, do you reckon? Is there thousand one is it like a new game plus maybe or you just like men to find the code later on and then you just like aha that was for that back there and i guess i'll just make a note of that for next time <laughs> seems like it doesn't it um sorry let me just uh exit it out there we go um interesting interesting guys uh well yeah i can i'm saying i'm clearly absorbed in the game that we've gone 20 minutes over schedule and didn't even notice um cool uh i mean yeah i'm enjoying it it's, it is a little awkward i'm finding the game awkward and i'm clearly not very good at it i'm the nuance of it uh but i feel like we're, we're making decent progress um we're uh oh nice nice email there excellent like that <laughs> uh we are we're, we're, i'm forging ahead in a very messy and unskilled fashion. It seems like we're doing it without decent weapons and without, like, proper resource management. There's got to be, like I say, there's some nuance to, like, playing this game well and it's just not fully gelled with me at the minute, but it's not stopping us from getting through it, seemingly, so far. I wonder how much more of the game is left. Um... As in, like, we do we get to the old woods and then we find the doctor and we're looking for our key and then however long it takes us to finally get that key, is it a case of once we get the, the 21 key and we get back to the 21 door, we get through it, is that completed the game? Or is that, is that like, oh, now you've done level one. Off you go. Another 20 levels to go. <laughs> Still on chapter one. Ah, I barely even touched it. Okay, interesting. Interesting. So I guess the end of chapter one is getting through the the door with the key and then be on to chapter two. I wonder how many chapters. Okay, curious. But yeah, I'm enjoying it anyway. But uh, guys, thank you all so much for being here. My God, it's been uh, quite the stream. I enjoyed it. Uh, so uh, thank you very much to... Um, bloody hell. Uh, Ryan, for the six gift subs. Uh, thank you very much to Twigsy for the five gift subs. Uh, also, thank you very much to Math Pink 420. Obviously, I don't know what they like to get through. Uh, <laughs> Dead Pet 7 and Fate 64 for the follows. I appreciate it. Um, completion rate of Chapter 2 is below 1%. Okay, damn. No, thank you. Thank you for being here, Fate. We're, uh, we're going to be back on this game tomorrow. I don't know what time zone you're on, Fate, but um, we are. Uh, for me, it's. Uh, is currently it's just i've gone after nine o'clock at night this is beyond my stream time um uh and uh you're in sweden oh excellent face you're probably an hour ahead of me so yeah i uh, i start uh t usually 2 p.m my time uh, and i stream every monday to friday i mean usually wrap up about now so if you are around tomorrow all fate we'll be con continuing right on with uh with uh dark woods and uh seeing you know how we can get so based on what you're telling me there thousand one either the game is very extremely difficult and it gets real real tough or i guess a lot just a lot of people have played it and a lot of people don't have the perseverance to stick with it they just kind of it like you know the, the concept maybe just wears thin and they're like yeah no I've, I've had enough i'm moving on to something else it's extremely difficult okay <laughs> um so i will say this now guys um as with any game that is an experiment game i do not i'm not I, i'm not committing to completing the game I, i'll push it as far as we can but if i get to a point of lack of interest or annoyance um you know i guess the difficulty like if maybe it's like a there's boss fights uh or maybe you kind of have to go through an area and there's like multiple savages attacking you all at the same time i mean it's maybe it's too much to handle i don't know i'll have to wait and see um but we'll uh We'll play it by ear. Either way, I'm excited to get back to it tomorrow. 
uh, and make some more progress. Yeah, it's definitely interesting. Um, but yeah, that's that's uh, that's very interesting. Thousand one. The um, completing chapter two is below one percent. I assume that's on uh, on Steam. Uh, my God, that's nuts. Uh, I'll, uh, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. So yeah, uh, only thing left for us to do: we'll go raid out. We'll see who's around. Um, if anyone wants to guide the raid, if you've got the points, you can, you want to welcome to do it. Let me see who's around. Um, if I raided this week so far. All oh, right. Yeah. Of course, we did Fallen Sleuth on Monday. Tuesday was a bust because uh, my internet died. Uh, and we raided kimchi yesterday. So let me see uh, what our potential options are. Oh, wow. The Phoenix is playing a Lundra. That's an excellent game. That's on my list. So I'm not going to raid him because uh, <laughs> I uh, don't want spoilers. Um, uh, uh, it looks like Walshy and Buck are playing some, some Tetris game. Like... Cole, I don't know. Uh, Walshy did uh, raid us the other day, so I do need to get him back for one. Um, Slight, uh, one of my best buddies, uh, he's playing Evil Within 2. Excellent. I also, that is also on my list, so for the sake of spoilers, we're not going to raid Slight. Um, it's a, 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 Lee. Lee's playing Parasite Eve 2. Sorry, Lee. Love to raid you. That's on my list. I don't want spoilers. Uh, <laughs> uh, ah, has been. If we raided Barrel in a minute, we're definitely not raiding this week. Uh, explosive Barrel's playing Tunic. I don't know what the bloody old Tunic is. The name rings a bell. Some little f fantasy fox guy running around. I don't know. Uh, what is in his title? He says, "What game has the best exploration?" Tunic. I don't know about that, buddy. I feel like we should find out. Um, all right, let's go raid Barrel. And see what this tuning game is all about. I don't know. Um, yeah, if you beat the whole game, you're not normal, allegedly. I don't know, uh, Thousand One. It's, it's definitely interesting. It's Zelda-like, is it, Red Mage? All right, let's go see Barrel. Oh, you know, I do bloody love Barrel. It's been a minute since I've seen him. Actually, we did one little raid moment the other day. Uh, but still, can't get enough explosive Barrel in your life. Um, there we go. Set up. Uh, but guys, thank you so much for being here. Uh, I will return tomorrow, same time as always. That's uh, 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, uh, if uh, you are over in that direction, uh, or 2 p.m. GMT. Uh, yeah, if anybody needs me between now and tomorrow uh, for anything, you please feel free to message me on the Conflux uh, or uh, jump on my DMs, whatever you, know, whatever you need to do. I need to get food. My God, I'm freaking hungry. Uh, chicken barrel. <laughs> uh, yes, let's go see him. Uh, Foxy Barrel, seemingly. Um, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, thanks for hanging out, guys, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Take care of yourselves.